more Pokemon Yella with bit crushed Pokemon voice. He's always the most fun in the world. Bit crushed Pokemons. I did some grinding off screen, primarily just to uh, n lessen the amount that I feel obligated to do. And I did use a. <laughs> it did took a while. I put the magic carp into the team to try and level it up some, and I basically just tried to level up everyone a little bit. I put Luna in so that we have a bit more variety instead of just uh, a Ratata, even though I did level him up a bit so he might come back in. But let us uh, fight Misty. And since we have Pikachu, I'm going to try and level up Deer. God. Hi, you're a new face. What's your policy on Pokemon? What is your approach? My policy is an all-out offensive with water-type Pokemon. Misty, the world-famous beauty, is your host. Are you ready, sweetie? I don't think I ever heard <laughs> Misty say sweetie once in all of Pokemon. Level 18. Alright, now... Switch in Pikachu so that Pikachu can annihilate. X defend? Well, that's just mean. Thundershock! Yeesh. At least it won't be. Or is it just neutral? That's kind of weird. Water on electric type doesn't. Like, it's normal. A bit odd. Level 15! Ah, oh, he finally learned Tackle! Huzzah. And Pikachu leveled up, too. I guess while we're... Ah, trying to learn Slam. Can't learn more than four moves. Hmm. Thunder Wave is... I guess Thunder Wave is okay. But at the same time, kind of not, because it's like... Paralysis... Is kind of an eh... I kind of like my thing, though. I'm not sure how good Slam is. That's the thing about Gen 1. You don't know the difference between moves. I'm, I'm gonna say no. Abandon learning Slam. Starmie. I shall change Pokemon. I shall throw out... Actually, let's see how well Bulbasaur does. Okay, Bulbasaur might die. I leveled up Bulbasaur some, got him Vine Whip! Of course you're using Flicknick's Defend. But things that I've been doing is I've... My brother advised me... Oh, fuck. That's not good at all. All-out offensive, huh? All-out offensive. But... My brother advised that I should, since I'm doing streaming and all that stuff. Bleh, my nose. <laughs> Excuse me. Since I'm doing art and streaming, that I should really look into learning live 2D VTuber avatar creation. Since it might help. Okay, that's just a lot of experience. I defeated Mosty. I can't believe I lost! Alright, you can have the Cascade Badge to show you beat me. And I got $2,000. Bulbasaur's evolving! <gasps> Do not touch any controls so that Bulbasaur can evolve properly. Huzzah! And now, I've got an Ivysaur. The Cascade Badge makes all Pokémon up to level 30 obey! That includes even outsiders. There's more. You can now use cut anytime. You can cut down small bushes to open new paths. You can also have my favorite TM. I received TM11. Oh yeah, that reminds me. I didn't want to do it while... Uh, grinding, because I just, I don't know, it felt wrong. But let's look at our TMs. We have Water Gun. Can you learn Water Gun, my dear little boy? Luna can, but not freaking Magikarp. That is hilarious. Uh, let's see, what's this one? Bide. I don't know if I want to give it to a Pokemon yet. TM1. Mega Punch. 
I could probably give that to Mankey, but I don't know. Team 11! Bubble Beam! Can you learn Bubble Beam? No. Once again, Luna can. I don't know why. I should probably say, but now we can go on adventures. After we heal up our Pokemon. But yeah, I'm gonna try and draw more and try and make an, a gremlin abomination of a VTuber avatar. And see how that goes. Because you have to make them a certain way, and then you have to have the meshes and the movements down. Luckily, there is a free version of Live 2D Cubism. Even though... It's like, they have a weird policy where, like, you can use the free version. Until you make, like, $87,000 a year or something. It's weird. But now let's go across to the bridge. Are you still there? Yep, you're still there, so... We have to go across Nugget Bridge, I think it's called. You bastard! Yo, Neon! You're still struggling along back here? I'm doing great. I caught a bunch of strong and smart Pokemon. Here, let me see what you caught. You little bastard. You little bitch boy. How many Pokemon you got? I have, I have a lot. Yeah, you only have four? A Spearow, huh? God. Well, now I'm gonna have my Pikachu annihilate you. I have no idea why. Thunder shock. But yeah, I'm gonna. <laughs> who knows? Maybe next time. Well, probably not, because I want to stream quite a decent bit. I just, I really should make uh, something like a schedule. It's about to use Sand Shrew. I forget. I think Ivysaur is good for. That maybe strike. Oh, Striker doesn't have any thing. Well, yeah, one of these days I might just appear with a abomination of a VTuber avatar. So that'll be cool. And then I can slowly work on up and have things. Oh, crit edition, Pokemon crit edition. Now you see, you little bastard. Now you see, a Radita. I know what to do with this one. I'll send out God, and then swap in Mankey. Gotta level up my boy. And I should also level up Striker. So yeah, after... Unless he has, like, a... Uh, a powerful enemy to fight. Striker will... <laughs> Critical Hit Edition! Mmm! Oh, uh, you're not even... You weren't even worth that much. Eevee, huh? Then a striker will take you down. Why do you... Why have you under-leveled your Eevee? You bastard. I still don't know why Gust is normal type. Critical hit edition. Mmm. But it failed! Mwahaha! <laughs> Your Eevee hasn't... How dare you use a sand attack? I'll finish you off! Fuck. Ow. Finish him off! One sand attack! One sand attack! Come on! Fuck off. I am highly annoyed now. Come on! Sand attack is an annoying piece of shit move. I it was like, a part of me wanted to use sand attack, but I didn't want to miss using sand attack. <laughs> so screw you, Gary. I beat you. Hey, take it easy. You won already. You critical hit my Pikachu and I beat you. Hey, guess what? I went to Bill's and got him to show me his rare Pokemon. That added a lot of pages to my Pokedex. After all, Bill's world famous is a Pokemaniac. He invented the Pokemon storage system on PC. Since you're using his system, go thank him. Well, I'd better get rolling. Smell you later. And now we can head back and heal our Pokemon again. Take that, Gary. I'm the winner. 
the wind roar. One of the things, I had a good Christmas Eve, and I'm doing this on Christmas, of course. Uh -huh. And of course, the, pe the Christmas pizza was very good. Love me some Christmas pizza. Eh, I... <laughs> I'm at that point where Christmas gifts is usually money and, like, small things like movies and games, because I don't have much to ask for. All I want like I don't know why, if it's muscle memory or what, that makes me think, oh, the Pokedex should be somewhere else. Now let's fight. This is Nugget Bridge! Beat us five trainers and win a fabulous prize! Think you got what it takes? I forget what the joke is about Nugget Bridge. I think it's like a pun or something. Or an innuendo. You should be able to defeat this Caterpie. Destroy the Caterpie. Make it loathe that it ever existed. Ooh. How dare you bondage my... <laughs> uh, Clefairy. Not Clefairy. Ah. I'm trying to think what your actual Pokemon Pokemon is. Blam my brain. A Weedle? I will not change. Luna will have a vengeance. Sing him to sleep. How dare you. And now watch him wake up in one turn, basically making everything meaningless. Beat him down. Beat him down. Now I can be the one to annoy my opponents into oblivion. I can be the monster, murdering my foes while they sleep. <laughs> oh yeah. Whoa, good stuff. I'm second. Now it's serious. This lass wants to murder you. Sing him to sleep. Especially after that. It didn't affect enemy Pidgey. Fuck off. No sand attacks. Pidgey no sand attack. The one downside, it adds just a whole section. I hate sand attack, it's such an annoying move! I hate sand attack! <laughs> Accuracy affecting attacks are so annoying. Ah. Finish it off, please, for the love of God, kill this Pidgey bastard. Ah! I hate you. I hate accuracy affecting bullshit. Ah! I know that's like par for the course when it comes to like, RPGs, but it's just like, oh! It hurts the soul so much to have to deal with. Alright, quick attack. Hopefully you don't have sand attack too. Especially because it, it would be one thing if sand attack was like this specific move done by one or two Pokemon. But it feels like so many Pokemon have sand attack or other accuracy affecting moves that I mean, I, I know. I use it. I use accuracy affecting attacks too. Like evade, or no, not. I forget. I think it's like a double team. <laughs> Making my Pikachu unattackable. But it is annoying. How could I lose? Because you had one plan annoy me, and that was your downfall. 
And I still swear that this game is harder than Pokemon Blue. Pokemon Yellow feels harder than previous Pokemon games that I've played. It could just be, like, nostalgia or my memory being on the fritz. Or it could just be that I suck. But at the same time, I, at the same time I say, it could just be me, young child I, going on a manic spree of grinding. Here's number three, it won't be easy. I'll show you what a real nugget is. Small boy, I'll kick your nuggets. Go Luna! Hey, that's the move that Lewis learned. Not gonna let you do that again. And you're gonna wake up in one turn to make me hurt. Beat down the little bitch. Make the Rattata know that he's Rattadan. What other things can I talk about? I've, oh yeah, uh, one of the games that I uh, got for Christmas was Risk of Rain 2. I have mixed feelings going through uh, playing it for like two, three hours. Uh, have pretty mixed feelings. Let's see. I shall throw out Striker. Let you get some experience. Yeah, it's just... It feels like, compared to Risk of Rain 1, it's super difficult getting... Uh, finding the teleporters... Like, they don't stand out as much. I feel like they should still have that, like, glow outline around them, but they don't. So, sometimes I would just walk right by them, or I'll be like, where the hell is it? <laughs> I'm looking for it. And then the final level, I kind of don't like the final level in Risk of Rain 2. Nice for you, Striker. About to use Zubat. I shall throw out Luna. See, well, or should I? Let's see. Let's have uh, God get a bit. Ooh, God can fight. He has tackle now. I hope you don't. Uh, you're not weak. Damn it! I use splash. Oh well. Let's see if it's super. That's uh, it's a critical hit. Oh, well. Tackle the bitch. But uh, the final level is kind of annoying because if you don't have movement options. How can you even hurt yourself? All you do is flop on the ground. <laughs> Already, it's no longer confused. Okay. But, yeah, I, I'm pretty annoyed because if you don't have movement options in the final level, it makes it super hard to progress. And you have... <laughs> it, you don't know what you're looking for when you first get to the final level. So you have no idea what to do or where to go, and there's a lot of holes that you can fall down, so that's annoying. And uh, so at first I'm like, okay, how do I find these pillars? And I didn't know their tell. Because the beams of light are not that noticeable, all things considered. And then... After you fill up all of the dilities, do I not have any potions? I have potions. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a bitch. I want my dude to get experience in a Pokemon battle. But after you do all of the pillars, then you have to find a bounce pad, which functions on the same thing. Ah, there's a beam of light. But once again, I don't know what I'm looking for. This is different than Risk of Rain One. And it's just like, uh, and then the final boss battle, it's very fun. The final boss is actually fun in Risk of Rain, but getting there is a pain. Not a fan of the final level overall, because it's tricky movement. Oh, and also, if you're a slow character, and you have no idea where the teleporter is for your few, first few runs, God have mercy on your soul. <laughs> it is aggravating. Ow, stomped flat. Striker is evolving. <gasps> My Pidgey is becoming greater. Eee. 
coming to Pidgeotto. Yay! And of course, go back and heal because I want to level up my dudes. I want them to be nice and good. I missed the run button. But yeah, learning the, like, differences between, like, Risk of Rain 1 and Risk of Rain 2 is, uh, a bit wonky. I've st I still suck at it. I feel like the difficulty's quite high. Oh yeah, and the final level, it does feel like the final level wastes your time in Risk of Rain 2. Because it's a lot of walking. So unless you have one or two of the run fast when out of combat items, you are going to take a long time getting to where you need to go, and if you don't have any other movement stuff like, uh, double jumps, you're also gonna be out of... <laughs> I'm number four, getting tired. I can go all night, because I'm the Pokemon champion. Lass wants to fight. Go, Luna. Sing this Pidgey to death. Don't let them use sand attack. God damn it. Don't let them sand attack. Come on. It's kind of, I know it's like a super powerful move, but at the same time, I'm a domainic character. I should be able to murder. And now it's going to wake up in one turn. But what else? I'm also thinking of... I still need to look at the Steam Winter Sale, pick up things there, because Steam, it's like cocaine. I'm trying to think things to say, besides commenting on the battle, which isn't much battle. A needle ran. Go, God! Will you survive, God? Can you beat this motherfucker? How did you miss? You're a fish! Why? Oh yeah, I forgot. Your base attack is super low. Fine. Let's see. Who could use Mankey? You can go beat up this Needle Ram. I hate doing it, but it's just like... Oh, this is one of those moves that can go on forever. Low kick this bitch. I wonder why it's not very effective. Fine, Karate Chop, which for some reason is normal. <laughs> why is low kick an, a fighting move, but Karate Chop, a thing specifically named after a martial arts move, even if it is a very basic martial arts thing, it's still named after martial arts. I'm not going to go back. I'm going to finish you off. Okay, I'm number five. I'll stomp you. You will not stomp me. I will stomp you. I right, sent out a manky. Sing! Dang it. Now you're dead, because that's going to be super effective. Let's see... Guess I'll send out Ivasaur. Level you up some. Vine Whip. Freaking critical hits! What is with the critical hits? I fucking hate them! They should be rare, not this hard. Fuck off! It's super annoying. Fuck off. <laughs> super annoying. Hey, I'm gonna karate chop you. Congratulations, you beat our five contest trainers. You just earned a fabulous prize. A nugget. I think all you can do with that. By the way, would you like to join Team Rocket? Oh, you motherfuckers of Team Rocket. We're a group dedicated to evil using Pokemon. 
Wanna join? Are you sure? Come on, join us. I'm telling you to join. Okay, you need convincing. I'll make you an offer you can't refuse. They have a weird recruitment method. Rocket wants to fight. <laughs> I forgot you're very low. Also now, Pikachu, heal up Ivasaur and beat you down. Do, 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 do. Go ahead, heal up Ivasaur some, even though it's not much. Ah, you're being this kind of bitch. I'm gonna let it play out so that I can just let my Pikachu get angry at you for a moment. You should have continued, you fool! Rap is such a weird move, because it basically does the, a normal amount of damage just over multiple turns, which just means I can do other things while you're doing minimal damage to my Pokémon. About to use Zubat. Alright. I'll send out God. Tackle! How much damage you do? Not much. Luckily, I don't think this will do much either unless it crits, which no in this game. Okay, good. Though it could also do supersonic, which could be annoying. What will you do? Hurt yourself. Oh no, God is emo. That was a critical hit. I think I'll bring... I don't know, maybe Striker in. Because just like, your attack is so low. It's so annoying. You're the same level, why can you not be good? Yeah, why can't you do more damage like that? It's a stinking tackle. Do damage. See? You are a fool. Ah, you are good! With your ability, you could become a top leader in Team Rocket. But I don't want to be a leader in Team Rocket. Still kind of... You know, with how much Team Rocket is a fan favorite in the Pokemon series, you'd think they would have made a Team Rocket game. But I guess they don't want <laughs> to have the crazy people that are like, oh, Pokemon is evil, have more footing. They're teaching kids to steal other people's pets. Which reminds me, apparently Kadabra has appeared in a Pokemon episode recently and apparently it's a big thing because there was this guy who was like Kadabra is based on me you know like a sociopath <laughs> this guy is just like this animal creature psychic is obviously stealing my likeness is just maddening and apparently that finally got squared away and the Pokemon Company and Nintendo, at the very least, don't fear him anymore. Maybe he died? <laughs> and nobody cares about it? Who knows? Fight me. I saw your feet from the grass. I know you mean like you saw my accomplishment on Nugget Bridge, but that sounds wrong. Quick, sing it to hell! Jesus fucking Christ. If it wakes up, you're dead, basically. Luckily, Luna is a serial killer of the night. So while you sleep, she murders. <laughs> You're fast asleep, and now you are 
dead. Of course, a critical hit at the very end. About to use Ekans. I shall swap out. Try and level up God some. Not even gonna try. Because I know how this goes. His attack is seven. <laughs> It's so annoying. Kick the snake. Ah, oh, come on. Kicking snakes is an evolutionary thing. I think I already tried kicking an Ekans before. What is with karate chop and uh, critting? What is with crittings? I have thought not. I'm gonna take Luna out of put God back in there so we can do more swapsy doodles I don't think there's anything down here but who knows maybe a bell sprout oh no and your water type get the hell out I f I forget well it doesn't really matter because <laughs> you don't have any air attacks <laughs> Well, technically, it has uh, Whirlwind, but that's just good for blowing the enemy away. Yeah, I thought Whirlwind would be a nice, good uh, air attack. No, it's basically Roar. It just blows enemy Pokemon away. Okay, yeah, this is just a training area. Want slightly better training? Want grass-type Pokemon? I have Bulbasaur. I don't really need you. I can't really use my beloved over here, though. But at least I can level up Striker some, too. You thought you were absorbing from a Water-type, but it was me, Striker! That's not gonna save you. And I guess this is also kind of a funny thing, because if this were, like, red or blue, you could come over here and catch some grass-type Pokemon to fight Misty with. Whereas, in this game, it is literally just, hey, <laughs> have a Bulbasaur. And once again, not gonna bother, because God has terrible stats. I just want to see how decent he becomes if... Really, I should stop trying to level him up. Because... If his stats are this bad as is, why didn't I use Thundershock? I'm dumb. I'm dumb! I'm not good at raising Pokemon. I should release my Charmander, because I haven't raised it well. If you promise you'll take care of it, it's yours. Yes, I got Charmander. I'll keep you the same. There's no room. Charmander was sent to the Pokemon Box 1. Take good care of my Charmander. Okay, we just got Charmander out of nowhere. TM45. Well, we're going to go back and grab Charmander. What's TM45? TM45 is Thunder... I already have Thunder Wave! My Pikachu learned it already. We're gonna go heal up and take out... Well, we're... Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll replace God with Charmander because... As much as I want a Gyarados, his base stats don't look good. His base stats basically scream he's going to just fail at everything. We already m know Bill is up there, but we haven't named. All right, sorry, uh, sorry, God. You're not good enough. Oh my God, we're gonna have to power level you so much, but we'll do a little bit of grinding. Uh, what attack, uh, since there's grass type, it shouldn't be that bad. We'll move you up here. What are your attacks, Charmander? He knows Ember! Hell yeah! He'll make quick mince meat out of grass types! Hell yeah! 
Yeah, this is a... <laughs> when it comes to getting Pokemon, like, that's super cool. Because, like, uh, I don't think I mentioned it last stream when we were playing this game. But, uh, the... Oh, you get uh, Bulbasaur down there, who is a person raising uh, injured Pokemon, healing them up. That's basically an episode from the anime. Same thing with this. I don't think I... Except that guy is much more self-aware than the guy who mistreated Charmander in the anime was. In the anime, he was just like, screw this Charmander, I'm gonna leave him here and let him die. <laughs> How you doing, Pikachu? Pikachu's happy with the slaughter. But we'll move on a bit. I, I said we were gonna grind, but... Who knows, maybe one of these fools will have grass types I can annihilate. Oddish. Go, Charmander! Use Ember on that fool. Hmm. It's probably because you're a low level. So even though you have type advantage, you're not doing that much more damage. I probably should have stopped my last stream after I beat Nugget Bridge and got Charmander, but I didn't know Charmander was here! Alright, fight me. I just got down from Mount Moon, but I'm ready. You're probably going to be rock types. Yep, which means... Hmm. I'll let Pikachu handle this one. So I don't think I have anything good for... fighting types. Paralyze this fighting type's muscles! Yeah, how much... I hate critical hits in this game. They are way too often. Critical hit edition. Da, 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 da. Is about to use Geodude. I think Bulbasaur would do good, but I'm going to send out Charmander so that he can level up some. But for some reason, I want to say... Uh, grass is good against rock again. I It has been freaking forever since I really played Pokemon, so my my advantage types, I'm not sure. Yep, he's dead. You worked hard. Have some money. Local trainers come here to practice. I don't think there's enough homes for this many local trainers to exist. Yeah, but you'd probably get annihilated. So, Mankey, defeat this. <laughs> I keep getting more Pokemon that I have to power level. Low kick this rat. Quit quick attacking. Is mean. Level 12! Spiro. Once again, send out the boy. We gotta level him up so that he can be useful in battle and hold on his own. Pikachu should be able to survive one attack from a level 15 Spiro. But it failed. But you wanted to... <laughs> this won't fail. It's Thundershock. You're decent. And I'm gonna go back and heal. I missed the run button from future games. I should also probably grab, like, because I get into complacency, so a part of me is just like, I should grab more Pokeballs. How many Pokeballs do I have? I have eight Pokeballs, so I don't really need any more. <laughs> Power Plant. 
Indigo Plateau, Victory Road. <laughs> Saffron Sility. I think I'll just buy a bunch of, uh... Yeah, I'll, I'll definitely buy some stuff, because I, I probably should have bought things before. Like, I'll probably buy more potions. That way I don't have to come back as much. The real victor of this game... I guess capitalism, but potions mainly. Oh, and another fun thing that happened with Christmas is for whatever reason, Amazon seems determined to give me... Uh, what is it? Diddly -dee. Determined to give me... Uh, like, European copies of, like, uh, video games. This is, <laughs> so it honestly feels like they're just like, oh, well, games are, most systems are like, like, actually, I think all systems of the main three are region free, so it doesn't matter which one it sends. So it's just like, it's just a pet peeve of mine. It's kind of annoying. And it's just like, so now I have to double guess. It's just like, did I <laughs> mess up? Did Amazon mess up? Who's to blame for there being this? <laughs> I just, I don't know. It's super aggravating. And it's just more like the principle of the matter. I'm an American. I want the ESRB. If they're going to control the world of video games in America, I want them. You scratch! Critical hit. Goddamn sand attack. Turn that sand to glass. Yeah, we got <laughs> we I, I didn't expect it to not do another one. But it failed. Scratch. See you fool. That's what you get. Just a little bit of grinding. Since Charmander is not gonna hold his own against a trainer Pokemon. Ah, Vinonat. Level sixteen. Uh, let's see if it's weak to Ember. It is. How much damage is you gonna do? Not much. Please don't get a crit and kill my boy. This is why we did it. And this is a decent fight for Charmander that isn't... Like Doomsday. Booyah! And we'll go ahead and use another potion. Kinda wish that we can. <laughs> wish that we could rearrange items more. You'd think that, like, your most used items would go to the top, but no. Fight me. You're probably a rock dude, so Charmander. You're going to see Bill? First, let's fight! Sent out an Onyx. Uh, do I have anyone that would actually be good against Onyx? Because... Do -do -do -do. Yes, Ivysaur! Because <laughs> for some reason my brain is like... Come on, Pidgeotto should be good, but it's just like, no, I think we did that before. It's wrong. It's all wrong. <laughs> Imagine an Ivysaur lightly tapping. Yay! Lightly tapping a giant onyx to death. Yay! This is why we share our experience. You're something. Thank you, Hiker Man! Dad took me to a great party on the SSN at Vermilion City! I still don't know why they decided to sink the SSN in the anime. Alright, you are a water type. 
once again, well, actually, hmm, who should go out? Let's see if Luna can handle you a bit. We can put you to sleep, maybe. Damn it. Sing it to sleep. Do, do, do. You fool, slow poke. So slow and pokey. Now die. Ah, critical hit. That scares me. That was a critical hit attack. Well, we should be able to do a decent amount of damage, so long as it doesn't wake up and use confusion and then confuse us with confusion. Ho 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 ho! It is asleep! It won't wake up before it is dead! Ho 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 ho! I am probably one of the worst trainers to fight. Kill it! Don't let it attack! <laughs> It's like stabbing it with a fork slowly throughout the night. Then right as it, I'm not, I'm not mad. I just ruined your party. Come on, so, hi, my boyfriend is cool. But I'm not your boyfriend. Come on, won't somebody use a grass type up in here? That's a poison type. Huh. You might be able to do it. Bring down that needle ran. Try Ember. Light that poison of fire. Ah, we're doing decent. Good job, Charmander. All the experience. Not double kick! That can attack double! No! I'm gonna be a bitch. I'm gonna be a bitch. Potion time for my boy! Another potion for the boy. I'm the worst type of trainer you wanna run into in the wild. It's not the Pokemon, it's me. I'm the monster. Take down that Nidoran! Of course, you get a critical hit at the very end. Another Nidoran! Uh, we'll swap you out so you can get more experience, but I'm not gonna subjugate you to more pain. Now. Actually, I think for some reason they're resistant. So I'm gonna send out. Uh, they're resistant to fighting types, I think, because they're poison or something? I don't know. Typing advantages? You annoy me. Sing it to death! Uh. It's using its own wonky singing. Quick, put it to sleep. Show it how to really sing, Luna. And now, kill. Kill. Kill the sleeping Nidoran in its sleep. Wow, it woke up really fast. But it weave in the playing field. Until it used Growl, how dare you? Haha, <laughs> doesn't help because a critical hit took you out. Mwahaha! <laughs> Power leveling, my dear boy. Ooh, learned Leer. That affects defense, I think. I know it keeps happening to me, but I don't know. I'm in a slump. Is it because of your boyfriend? Did your boyfriend put you in a slump? And yep, I'm using a lot of my potions, but that's the point. I'm rich. It's to save me time. Fight me. You're a, a rock dude. I'm off to see a Pokemon collector at the Cape. What is the, like, geographical definition of a Cape? Like, uh, yeah, I forget. Bleh. It's a rock type, so we don't want to subjugate you to that. Not subjugate, but... Eh, my brain. Go, Ivysaur! <laughs> you have popped this Geodude like Pez. The best way to level. <laughs> Another Geodude. Do you just have Geodudes, my dude? <laughs> 
reminds me of a thing that I should, like a... Like a, a comic video joke idea that I should make and post to Twitter. Hi there, I'm Brock, the rock gym leader of Pewter City, and I'm gonna murder you with a rock! Geodude. It <laughs> just throws Geodude at you. Ah, huh, Machop, eh? I'll send out Charmander again, see what level you are. Level 13? You should be able to handle him. Burn him alive! Set his muscles a-quake! It's gonna crit, isn't it? I hate you. <laughs> I hate Karate Chop. Why does it get crit so much? Why do you get crits so much? It is a normal type move. Is its gimmick it does crits? Okay, it didn't crit there. Probably shouldn't have attacked because that was just meant that it could have possibly, possibly crit again. Eh, my dude can stay out there and then I'll swap to Ivysaur again. Or, yeah, Ivysaur. Venusaur comes next. I like to imagine that he was like, Quick, Geodude, attack the Charmander before he gets away! And then right mid-tackle, Ivysaur comes out. You got me! What? Charmander's already evolving! Power leveling! Yay! Charmander evolved into Charmeleon! And now I'm gonna head back and heal up my Pokemon. And maybe buy more potions, because I just chugged them. Pokemon, it's a game of patience more than anything. Do you want to spend your fortune on potions? Or will you actually go to the free Pokemon Center that's like 30 seconds away? Will you spend $2,000 to save 30 seconds? Speedrunner says yes. <laughs> that really does make me f think, like, if there was, like, a no-holds-barred thing to, like, speedrunning, what would the upper limit of speedrunners do? Like, what money would they spend? If it turned out that there was one type of, like... <laughs> official uh, hardware out there and it was like super rare but for whatever reason it interacted with a game in this specific way that saved you a ton of time you know that speedrunners would be throwing just wads of cash to get that official hardware only for then speedrunning forums to have to have the debate does this official hardware need to be banned because it gives an advantage despite the fact that it's official hardware? <laughs> it would be a strange, not really philosophical question, but a strange question. Because it is something that you can spend tons of money on to, in this theoretical sense, you could spend a ton of money on this quote-unquote official hardware thing, and it would give you an advantage. Aha, I did it right. Now I can walk in. I'm a cool guy. I've got a girlfriend. Get you're not with her. There's a big rock climber between you and your girlfriend. Plus you're a junior trainer. What the hell's wrong with you? Charmeleon. Ember the rat. <laughs> Throw that rat into a, a, a fryer. Charmeleon always looked weird from behind. It's about to use Ekans. We won't change. We don't need change. We don't need your pennies. I smell pennies. Of course you 
poison my goddamn million. I hate your snake. Wow! You are actually a bigger dick than me. Haha, -ha, I poisoned your Pokemon. Now I'm going to wrap your Pokemon so it can't do anything and get hit by both the poison and the wrap. I could swap them out, but that's inefficient. Die. God, imagine an Ekans with superior speed. Nightmare World. Aw, oh, darn. Your girlfriend is now my girlfriend. I'm cooler than you! What's TM19? Let's look. It contains Seismic Toss! We can throw Pokémon to orbit. And now I have to go all the way back. Because my junior trainer poisoned my goddamn million. Charmeleon. War Turtle. 150. Yep, that's what I expected. And more to see. To be a Pokemon master is my destiny. I love Pokemons. We heal Pokemon back to perfect health. My cat used the perfect chance to want out because I have to open the door. It's just like, ah. Eh. Just a nice little audio insulation. Close my door so that other people don't hear me screaming. Such madness to the world. And he's just like, okay, now I went out right as the Pokeballs were going into the machine. What even is that machine? What does it do? How does it heal Pokemon? What is its secrets? I wonder, I wonder what the Pokemon theorists think of that machine. It can heal everything and rejuvenate Pokemon to their top tier. You, fight me. Stand by this rock. I knew I had to fight you! Why? Why did you know that you had to fight me? Young man. Oh boy, you're gonna poison my Charmeleon too, aren't you? Ember this bastard. Set him ablaze. Quick, burn him alive so that he doesn't poison you. God damn it. That Ekans has one health. Don't let it get away. Hell yeah. Charmeleon's just leveling up quickly. About to use Sand Shrew, huh? Who do we want to level up? Hey, Luna, you come in here and get a, a smack. Put him to sleep! Damn it! Alright, try again. Put him to sleep! God, I could not imagine fighting another real life person in Pokemon Generation 1. Granted, I don't really do, like, PvP at all. So I wouldn't really like fighting people in Pokemon <laughs> games as is because they're like, I'm going to use the status effects. I'm going to use all these things. And then they're going to have extra special things like they're going to have IVs and th they, these special things like making an immortal Pokemon by swapping abilities and traits. Yeah, I knew I'd lose too. You are a strange child. You knew you would lose. Who are you? My friend has a cute Pokemon. I'm so jealous. Are you gonna send out Muck and be like, this is my Pokemon. It's ugly and hideous. You have finally, 
finally the perfect victim. Kill. Critical hit super on a poor Oddish. Bye bye. About to use Pidgey. You want cute? Hmm. Doo -doo -doo. I was gonna send in Mankey, but I don't want to risk this Pidgey having an uh, aerial attack. Put him to sleep before he can use Sand Attack! Whoa, <laughs> you fool. Now, crush that Pidgey in its sleep like a bag of puppies. It's like once they're near death, the adrenaline wakes them up. <laughs> so dark and disturbing. Is about to use another Oddish. Hmm. Hey, Menke. Get in there and murder. Once you actually level up your Pokemon to the proper point that they can actually handle themselves, Karate Chop, get a critical for me! I hate that move so much! <laughs> Whenever I see a critical hit in this game, I just get irrationally angry, and a part of me goes, Oh, so this is what it feels like to hate random crits in Team Fortress 2. I'm not so jealous. Hey, I'm jealous. I'm not so jealous. Sea Cottage. Bill lives here. His full name is Sea Cottage Bill? My god. Well, let's talk to him. <laughs> Pikachu is interested in this Pokemon. Pikachu is confused. Hiya, I'm a Pokemon. No, I'm not. Call me Bill. I'm a true blue Pokemaniac. Hey, what's with that skeptical look? I'm not joshing you. Where does that even come from, joshing you? I don't even know. I screwed up an experiment and got combined with a Pokemon. So how about it? Help me out here? Sure. When I'm in the teleporter, go to my PC and run the cell separation system. Why do you even have that system? Am I going to be confused with Pikachu? I initiated the teleporter's cell separation. I'm alive! Pikachu is shocked. <laughs> Ha! Thanks, bud. I owe you one. So, did you come to see my Pokemon collection? You didn't? That's a bummer. I've got to thank you. Oh, here, maybe this will do. A ticket to the SSN! That cruise ship SSN is in Vermilion City. Its passengers are all trainers. They invited me to their party, but I can't stand fancy dues. Why don't you go instead of me? <laughs> what do you think, Pikachu? Pikachu is still confused. He just left his Pokemon in the teleporter. I guess this is just a sea cottage. <laughs> we ran the gauntlet and got an SSN ticket. Oh god, I haven't even thought about it. Who am I going to make my HM whore? One of my Pokemon's gonna have to become burdened down with HMs. And I don't- oh, Hey, the, the, the rocket guy is gone. I guess that means that uh, Ginny will let us through that house. Probably. Wait. I have a thing. I want to look at this. The one to the right. The fuck? Where does this go? What's up there? What- I don't even know what the purpose of that path to the right is. And I'm like, is that a place that you go in the future? Or is that just there? There's a ledge. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't understand. Kadikaris is a funny YouTuber. This non sequitur has been brought to you by me. Do, 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 do. Bob, it'll be 
really interesting playing through a lot of Pokemon games through the ages. So, Pikachu, what do you think of our journey so far? Pikachu is happy with the strangeness. All right, Ginny. I hope you'll let us through, because we don't have any HMs. These poor people were robbed. We're positive that Team Rocket is behind this terrible deed. Even our police force has trouble with the rockets. Yeesh. Team Rocket must be trying to dig their way into no good. Those miserable rockets. Look at what they did here. They stole our TM for teaching Pokemon how to dig holes. That cost me a bundle, it did. I wonder if I can give it back. Hey, stay out! It's not your yard! Huh, me? I'm an innocent bystander! Don't you believe me? Dude, you are wearing all black and you look like a rocket man. So I'm gonna send you to space. Rocket wants to fight! This will be partially easy. Critical hit! And you're gonna get one too, aren't you? Wow, you didn't. Ha! <laughs> You suck. RNG hates you. And now it's going to come back to eat me. Ah! Burn his muscles. Make him atrophy. Gonna send out Drowsy, huh? Well, how about we fight Drowsy with Drowsy? I'll put this Drowsy to sleep because I'm a bastard. Sing! Try and hypnotize your way out of that, you drowsy schmuck. Pound him into the dirt. I mean, he's probably trying to learn dig, so we're just trying to help you here. Pounding you into the dirt so you can learn to dig better. And once you're in the red, the adrenaline will spike. You'll feel your death coming. Oh, wow, you're, you're okay with dying in your sleep. Okay, bye. <laughs> Stop! I give up! I'll leave quietly! Okay, I'll return the TM I stole. You didn't even steal from me. I better get moving. Bye! You want it back? I figure what's lost is... I decided to teach Diglett how to dig without a TM. <laughs> I guess that's one way of doing it. Should I go back? Eh, Charmeleon is, could use a healing. He got crit good. I hate crits in this game. They hurt my soul. And I hate Karate Chop the most. It's a normal... I I think that's why it's normal. People were making this game. It was just like, Karate Chop, it should get extra critical chance. And then they realize, oh, but not that many things are affected by fighting. And in fact, there are a lot of things that are resistant to fighting. Let's make it normal so that we have more critical chance. A metagamer designed that move! I don't even see your diglet. Dee doo! Dee doo! Do -do 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 Let's check the map. Check the map, check the map. We can, uh, let's see. Lavender Town. I don't think we want to go to Lavender Town just yet because we need the self-scope. I remember that. Who even built this fence? And I have to walk both sides because I want to know the truth. Oh, I think that's the daycare, so if you want something to level up while you're gone, you can. I'm not sure if I wanna, but at the same time, I probably should. I don't want any of my current team, but maybe I can throw... Ah, but that means going back and forth. Maybe once we get cut. <laughs> I'm lazy. 
Who even needs the daycare when you can just quick swap your Pokemon? Underground path to Cerulean City, Vermilion City. Is it because you need a bike to get through? I think that's the reason why. Let's see. Let me guess I need a bike. I'm on guard duty. Gee, I'm thirsty though. Oh wait, the, ro <laughs> the road's closed. So I need to go and get like a uh, water or something. Hello, child. Hi, do you have Cubone? Wanna trade it for a Machoke? No. I don't have a Cubone. And I prefer Cubone to a Machoke, actually. I just like that Pokemon better. I'm not a type person. Hello there. People often lose things in that underground path. Well, I didn't see anything. Underground path, Cerulean City to Vermilion City. Do 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 do. Let's fight, 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 fight. Gotta level up, my dude. Ember this rat. Rat this rat. Crotical head. And since there seems to be some normal types out, we'll try and level up Mankey some. Let's go up here, see if there's any secrets. Don't know why there's a ledge here, I guess just... Hey, let's get the geography of this place interesting. Hey, are you thirsty too, guard man? I'm a guard today. Gee, I'm thirsty. Every... all the guards are thirsty. Hello there. There aren't many bugs out here. I gee, I wonder which Pokemon trainer you are. No way, a bug catcher. Oh yeah, I think these are the guys <laughs> we learned before. Kicking bugs, that doesn't work. Karate chopping the bugs, now that's the way to go. And plus it gets, <laughs> I feel dirty using critical hits. Critical hit. Hmm, I should probably level up Pikachu some as well. He's my main. Thundershock the bastard. I don't even need a karate chop to crit you. My Pikachu will handle your poison. You lying little lie lie. Ah, good, you're just into bondage. Do 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 do. No, you're kidding! And now I shall steal your dollar! <laughs> Alright, I'm just wandering around making sure I don't miss anything. I shall save and fight these two. That reminds me of the innuendo double battle in another game. I've never played, I don't think I played that one. But it's like one has an onyx, one has a cloister. I'm doing this out of love, leave me alone. That sounds disturbing. Weeping Bell. Hey Mankey. Kick him in the bell. Fuck. Uh, of course you would. You. Karate chop him. Get some crits and I no longer feel bad. So you poisoned me and now you're growing. How dare you. It's such a cheap move. It's such a cheap move. It just gets crits like crazy. No. This can't be! And I made off with your three dollars. And now my dude is poisoned! 
Well, let's see if all our Pokemon can get poisoned. Fight me. I'm training for my love. Don't bother me. I should probably talk to them again. Well, at least they're of the same age group this time. Ah. Give it nightmares about its dead mother! If you could steal Pokemon in this game, we could steal this Cubone and trade it for a Machoke. Beat down that Cubone. Pound it into the ground. Beat down that Cubone. Beat it into the ground. Quick, put it to sleep again! I am the worst type of person. I am a monster. God, if I were a real trainer in a real Pokemon world, I would have so many people that are like, You don't fight for fun! You're like three levels higher than me. Of course I'm gonna put your Cubone to sleep and beat it up while it's on the ground sleeping. Ambush tactics! Ambush tactics! And Luna didn't even get a scratch on her. Ooh, and learned double slap. Now she can knock people out and then slap them to death. My textbook never. Now I understand Pokemon isn't about calculated numbers. It's about putting your enemy to sleep and beating him up. My love will leave me in disgust. <laughs> well, we better... Mankey is going to... Might as well speed up the process a bit. Level up as much as possible. I've never seen you around. Are you good? No, I'm bad. Bad to the bone. Ah, Butterfree. We haven't seen you before and you're level 20. Ah, hell. Karate chop the bug out of the air. Of course you would. What are you going to do, Minky? Are you going to get a crit? Hell yeah. He's poisoned and confused. Why would you supersonic? He's already confused. I think the fact that you tried to supersonic him again is what made him hurt himself in confusion. But don't worry, Mankey. I have potions for days. So I can make you suffer this poison forever. Karate Chop, this bug man. Why are you using <laughs> supersonic so much? What is wrong with your AI, Bugman? Congratulations, you can use Supersonic again. I'm not sure if it's going to help you. If you're just going to keep using Supersonic. Now I have to use another potion on you to extend the agony. Why are you just using Supersonic? If you used other moves by now, you could have probably beat me. Or at least my main key. This match will never end. Jesus Christ. I don't want to risk, because it seems like he's doing so much damage to himself. Stop super sanicking my manky. What you gonna do, manky? Kill the bug? Yay. Hell yeah. You are too good. And I'll put Pikachu in the driver's seat a bit. Try and level him up since he's supposed to be in my main. Well, that was fast. <laughs> Give me a Pidgey or something. Yay! Now you're gonna die. Kill it. Vermin. Ew. Time to die. Ha <laughs> ha. See if there's anything over here. Nope. All right, what you gotta say? Me? Well, okay, I'll play. I'm trying to walk past you. You think strangers walking in front of you is an invitation for combat? Well, your Pidgey's gonna fucking die. <laughs> Let's play Undertaker. 
Wow. Although I think I know why Gust is normal type now. I guess they didn't want the player character running into the possibility of a starter Pokemon in an early place having an uh, elemental attack as its base attack. Because all it has is Gust instead of Tackle. So if you got, like, Charmander, I think, or something, you would run into a situation where your starter Pokemon is weak to one of the earliest Pokemon that you'll be running against, and you might want to uh, train your Pokemon up, and you'd be running into elemental assholes. Just didn't work. Hmm. Everyone's pretty evil, even leveled. Hey, Striker, maybe you can fight this dude. Huh? You want to talk to me? I'm walking by you. The only reason I'm walking by you this close is because I know that you're going to attack me. Junior Trainer wants to kill you. My Pidgeotto is grander than your silly Pokemon. Quick attack! You use growl? You're a bird. You can't even growl. Ha ha ha! Jesus Christ, it's fractioning my attack! Another? Oh, eradicate, huh? Sand attack! How dare you hyperfang my Pokemon! Now you will die. Now I will die. Well, time to use some uh, potion. <laughs> I'm the worst type of trainer. How dare you? Ah, you're gonna play this game, huh? Hey, Mankey, come out here and kick this rat. Low kick. Are you gonna kill all my Pokemon this way? Wow, you're a fucking asshole! I'm gonna put you to sleep and murder you! I don't know why, Hyper Fang is a scary move for some reason. I wonder if it's one of those moves that gets extra crit. Slap this Pokemon to death in his sleep because he killed your friends. How is it that the level 16 Raticate is scarier than the level 18 Spiro? Or was it Eradita? My memory's shot. How is it that the Pokemon... Oh no, I, I, was, I was about to say, how is it possible that my poisoned Raticate survived all that? The truth is, he didn't. <laughs> He's dead already. He was the second one to die. That's why I sent out Luna to put the Raticate to slip. Ah, <laughs> oh, the agony. Now let's talk. Who? Why is there always one dude just on the bench who is in a different color palette? It is true that a higher level Pokemon will be more powerful, but all Pokemon will have weak points against specific types, so there is no universally strong Pokemon. But what about Mewtwo? My Pokemon was poisoned. It fainted while we were walking. Yeah, that's my nightmare. Even if they are the same level, Pokemon can have very different abilities. A Pokemon raised by a trainer is stronger than one in the wild. But what about a Pokemon that you catch in the wild and then you train? And now... Pokemon Home Invasion version. I'm the fishing guru. I simply love fishing. Do you like fish? Sure. Grand, I like your style. Take this and fish, young one. Fishing is a way of life. From the seas to rivers, go out and land the big one, young one. I wonder how many fishermen have died to Gyarados in this world. Did you see the SSN moored in the harbor? No. Talk to me. 
We're careful about pollution. We've heard Grimer multiplies in toxic sludge. I just caught a squirrel that was always getting into mischief. I think it needs a good trainer to set it straight. I guess I need to prove myself that I'm the, the right trainer that will set it straight. And now to buy super potions. Ice heal, awakening, paralyze. Yep, I'm going to buy some super potions. Why? Because I'm an asshole. <laughs> Wait, I can sell that nugget I got. Yeah. Nope. I want to sell, I want to sell some things like this nugget. 5,000? Sure, I can buy more super potions with it. What will you give me for this nugget? Five super potions. I think Pokemon can be good or evil. It depends on the trainer. Pikachu is super happy. Pikachu's energized to murder. There are evil people who will use Pokemon for criminal acts. Team Rocket traffics in rare Pokemon. They also abandon Pokemon that they consider not to be popular or useful. Hey, that sounds like the fan base. Koroko! Dear Peepee, -pee, I hope to see you soon. I heard Saffron has problem with Team Rocket. Vermilion appears to be safe. I'm getting my Pidgey to fly a letter to Saffron in the north. Carrier Pidgeys. The most... <laughs> the newest innovation in Pokemon technology. Fuck, I need to get cut. I can't get Squirtle yet. Because I probably need to beat the gym, and then she'll give me the... the... Once a Pokemon learns the NHM, that technique can't be replaced. Better think carefully before you teach HM moves. I forgot that HMs are evil. What's this? Pokemon Fan Club. All Pokemon fans, welcome. Pikachu is interested. Pikachu is in love! Beep -be. Won't you admire my Clefairy's adorable tail? I already did. Our chairman is a very vocal about Pokemon. And who's this? A seal. Oh dear, my seal is far more attractive. I chair the Pokemon fan club. I have more than a hundred Pokemon. I love them all. I'm very fussy when it comes to Pokemon. So... Did you come to hear me brag about my Pokemon? Yes. Good. Then listen up, my favorite Rapidash. It, cute, lovely, smart, plus amazing. You think so? Oh, yes. It, stunning, kindly, love it, hug it, when sleeping, warm, and cuddly, spectacular, ravishing. Oops, look at the time. I kept you too long. Thanks for hearing me out. I want you to have this. I can get a bike now. Exchange that for a bicycle. Don't worry, my Fero will fly me anywhere. So I don't need a bicycle. I hope you like cycling. <laughs> Come on, Pikachu. We got a bike voucher by listening to a guy ramble. <laughs> Pikachu is in super love. Too bad that person is an NPC and not important to the story. Notice! Route 12 may be blocked off by a sleeping Pokemon. Detour through Rock Tunnel to Lavender Town. Vermilion Police. Diglett's Cave. Vermilion Harbor. Should we do SSN now? I probably. I don't think we can go anywhere else. SSN is a famous luxury cruise ship. We visit Vermilion once a year. Hmm. I wish the, the map was easier to navigate, but let's see. So, ah, we get back. Where are we again? We are in Vermilion City. Huh, Lavender Town, yeah. Because the only way to get there is either around about that way or that way. 
So we can't really get... So it's basically only head to Lavender Town, but we can't really do anything at Lavender Town yet. Maybe we can get cut at Lavender Town? Rock Tunnel. So it seems either way you're going through a tunnel to get to Lavender Town. So I think what I'll do is I will head back, get a bicycle. Well, first we'll go on the SSN because I don't think it I, I don't think it moves. I think it just leaves. Welcome to the SSN. Welcome to the SSN. Excuse me, do you have a ticket? Flashed the SS ticket like a baller. Great. Welcome to the SSN. The passengers are restless. You might be challenged by the more bored ones. Yeah, I think this is where we get an HM. You pop! How dare you barge in! Get off my lawn! And by that, I mean I'm going to kill you. Well, looks like it's gonna be a leveling experience. Quick attack! Ah, critical hit. Ah, crap, it's gonna... Ah, ha, ha. For some reason, like, fighting's not good against flying types. I guess it's supposed to be like, well, flying, they're going to be far away. Yeah, he leveled up too! Another Nido ran, huh? We'll have... Hmm. Yeah, we'll have... L let's play it slave. <laughs> play it slave. Let's play it safe and have Luna put this one to sleep. Sing it to sleep, baby! No, it's deaf! It can't hear you! We shall drill the music into its skull. And now, my dear Clefairy, double slap it to death! Hit the enemy three times. And now let's compare three slaps to pound. Eh, kind of comparable. Keep up the pressure! Murder it to death! If you dare poison my beloved Clefairy, good. I would be very annoyed. It's like that needle round would be like, I spite you and poison you. Humph, you rude child. I'm so rude that he gave me a lot of money. Hello. Waiter, I would like a cherry pie, please. You're not gonna fight me? Do I look like a waiter to you? Maybe he's talking about Pikachu. Pikachu would be an adorable waiter. The cruise is so elegant yet cozy. Wiggly Tough. What do you think, child? I always travel with Wiggly Tough. A true Pokemon trainer in the training. Bonjour! I am Lewetta on the ship! I will be happy to serve you anything you please. Ah, le strong silent! <laughs> Lean on that fourth wall! Well, I guess not really. It's most like, aha, uh -huh, the character doesn't talk much, but that kind of is. Fourth walling. Eh. We are curious around the world. Uh, oh, I didn't think you were going to fight me. I love Pokemon. Do you? You're going to be a Pokemaniac, aren't you? Oh, no, you're just a child. Oh, no, it's a e demon child. Let's see if... Send attack! Pocket save. <laughs> and now, beat him up. Beat up that needle ran while he has pocket sand in his eyes. Mwah! I am the worst person in the world. Finish him off with a quick attack. He'll have one HP left, won't he? Ah! But he missed. Ah! I am the greatest. I just need to start throwing pocket sand out at every now and then. How wow, you're great. And what's this? T 
TM08. What that be? I, I, I don't use TMs. It's just like, it's that kind of a, uh, but what if I need it later feeling? What is this, though? Body slam. I was gonna say, hey, oh, I forgot. <laughs> I collected these Pokemon from all around the world. It's gonna be one Pokemon, isn't it? You use plural and you're only gonna have one, aren't you? Oh no, you have two. You have two Pokemon from all around the world. Your Pidgey isn't level, uh, isn't evolved. For that crime, I'm gonna kill you. No, not Sand Attack, you pocket sand it, my beloved Pikachu, you monster. Am I gonna have to super heal Pikachu? Oh dear God. Okay, uh, you just decide not to uh, quick attack that time, huh? I still am annoyed that that is a normal attack. I already went over why. It makes sense that it's a normal attack, but that doesn't mean I have to like it. Just give Pidgey tackle. I swear, if it's a second Pidgey, I'm gonna laugh. Oh, it's a Nidoran. Now let's swap it out. Hey, Luna, time for another murder! Put it to sleep. Oh, God. Put it to sleep. Ah! Sing! Ah! My Clefairy has stage fright. And after being beaten up a bit, it decides to sing out of spite. It's like a musical. What? It... D -d Turn one, wake up! Oh dear, that's the first time I've seen that! Oh, good. Double slap it to death, Luna! Yeah, that was that is an angry needle ran. Oh god. Sleep it! Put it to sleep. That it is a very angry insomniac needle ran. People probably relate to it like instant wake up. All right, now pound it into the ground for the finish. Yeah, it was worth it because of the level up. Oh no, I went around the world for these. You mean... You... I, 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 I call you liar. You did not go around the world for these Pokemon. I can get them in my backyard. Just a few potions to top up my Pokemon. Might need another one on Striker, but I'll let some other Pokemon get some experience first. All right, hey, Charmeleon, would you like to bash some of these water wusses? Hello, old man. Shush, I'm a global police agent. I'm on the trail of Team Rocket, then why'd you tell me? If I joined Team Rocket at the Nugget Bridge, you'd be fooled. You'd be fooled by me, child. I travel alone on my journeys. My Pokemon are my only friends. Well, relatable. Ooh, fire type on fire type battle, eh? All right, Charmeleon, Leer. And now growl. I probably should have growled first, all things considered. Because now he has two attacks on me. And he got a critical. Scratch him! Why would you do that? I'm resistant to fire. Eh, better use a heal because this is Pokemon Crit Edition! He'll probably get a critical because that's just how this works. What did I say? This is 
freaking Pokemon Crit Edition. <laughs> Roar! Uh, I guess he just missed, but it has different words for miss, and it's like it's not affected. Another Growlithe. Okay, I'm not sure who I would send out because... I don't really have anyone that could take advantage of the typing. So, you stay out and keep... Bully him. Growl! And Leer. Why are you using Ember, old man? I can see why you have Pokemon as your only friends. They're the only ones who would like you with your typing attacks. I feel sorry for you. Roar should have worked by now. I'm super sorry. And I swear if that crits. Okay. I probably should have healed because I think a crit bite does 20 damage. Ooh, I just realized something. Gary's... Ah, oh, damn it, I forgot. I didn't read his words. You should be <laughs> nice to your friends, I think they said. I'm I'm too impatient. I keep going super fast. Gotta go fast. Deja vu. Slide. And I'll go ahead and use another potion to top you off. Because we're going to run into Gary again in here. Because of course we are. All right, Mankey, you can have some fun here, too. I really should give you, like, seismic toss and stuff or something. Then what does the other side have? I don't mind walking around here because this isn't a cave. I hate caves in this game. <laughs> it was only one cave. It was kind of my fault, but meh. Meh. Huh. I don't think I've ever been here before. I saw an oddball in the trash. You, mon petit, we are busy here! Out of the way! Ahem, indeed, I am Le Chev! Le Mencos is prime beef steak! But have I enough filet de boeuf? <laughs> I only get one. <laughs> I only get to peel onions! <laughs> Poor you. I found a great ball! What? I have no room for items? There's an item limit? Oh. I am angry. Well, it's not like, uh... Hmm... What is a move that I don't care about? Bide. Quite honestly, I'm never gonna use bide. Bye. That's probably going to annoy a lot of people. Because I know Bide is probably a good move, but I don't like it. Did you hear about Snorlax? All it does is eat and sleep. Hey, like me. Nope, only trash. Here, hum de hum hum ho. I peel spuds every day. Hum hum. There's only trash here. Like me. I'm the trash man. I shall save because we're going to be running into Gary, and I'm scared of Gary! He stole my Eevee from me! This ship, she is a luxury liner for trainers! At every port, we hold parties with invited trainers! No, 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 I want to explore. Hello. In all my travels, I've never seen any Pokémon sleep like this one. It was something like this! <laughs> sleeping. You're not gonna get that Pokeball? Check out what I fished up! Oh no! It's a fish man! Ah! Fisherman wants to fight! Hey, you know what? We should... Uh, we'll let Mankey kick some fish, and then we'll let Pikachu have fun. Haha, <laughs> you flinched. Now for the uh, most annoying attack in the game, a critical chop. You know Peck? What? Why do you know Peck? You are a fish! 
I know that you have a horn, but that should be horn attack. Okay, now you annoyed me, Pikachu. Turn these fish to filet. Acid. Oh no. It plays some disturbing demon sound. Of course it gets a critical hit because it's Pokemon Critical Hit Edition! <laughs> you will find no aid here. Fish. Die. Try your peck. Your peck won't work because you don't have a beak. But that's besides the point. It is classified as an air move, and Pikachu is resistant to air. Because he doesn't fly. And now time to use more potions. <laughs> I could use the uh, the rare candy, but I kind of don't want to. And we'll heal up Pikachu as well. Hey, don't worry, Mankey. I'm sure you won't run into another Pokemon that can do peck without having a beak. I peck you with my fleshy lips. Competing against the young keeps me youthful. I don't know why. That sounds kind of disturbing, but at the same time, it makes sense. And I don't know why. Me. Voltorb. Volt is level 22. Oh my god. Kick it! It's a ball! Oh no. Critical hit. Karate chop! Okay, good. It just decided to screech. Now get that crit, please, Mankey. Be a good monkey. Get crit. I hate you. Bye bye, Mankey. We loved you well. Just random dude with super powered diddly d. Hey, Ivasaur, kill this Voltorb for great experience. Mankey just gets the worst of it. Is about to use Magnemite. Hmm. Who should I throw out there? Charmeleon. Steel type doesn't exist yet, so Ember shouldn't do much, but let's try it anyway! Quick, growl, so that it won't do as much damage! That works. And now, Ember! Luckily, we growled. Jesus Christ. Quick, Leer! Go ahead and use a potion on you. And now it's going to use a sonic boom. Okay, good. It just tackled. Of course, it gets a critical hit anyway. Mm. We got a critical hit too. I'm scared. It's going to pull out the sonic boom and do massive damage at any moment. You missed, and now's my chance! Defeat that Magnemite! Good fight! I feel young again. I'm gonna have to run back and heal. No more room for items. Alright, I'm gonna run back, heal, and sell a bunch of my TMs, I guess. Because I, I don't remember there being an item limit. God, my memory is terrible. Because we have to go sell the... Well, actually, while we're here, right here. I'm going to go ahead, sell my rare candy. I'm never going... No, not that. Eh. <laughs> Sell the rare candy. I'm never going to use it. I kind of want to keep the ether. 
Yeah, I have way too many. Let's see. Let's go through... TM12, what are you? Water gun, I'm saving you for... Squirtle, because he's coming up. Mega Punch. Sure, Mankey. Well, a lot of can. Luna can learn Mega Punch. That amuses me. But I think Luna might become my HM slave. Charmeleon can learn. Can't learn more than four moves. Delete a move? Sure. Forget Scratch. We don't use Scratch with you, because you have Karate Chop. Karate Chop is just a better Scratch. TM12. Water Gun. Oh, yeah, we already looked at that. I forgot. It boomed us back up. 11. Bubble Beam. Also for our dear boy Squirtle. Thunder Wave. Sell you. We don't need you. 45 is a sell. Seismic Toss. Uh, hey, Mankey, you, we, uh, you're just going to be our pure offense. You can forget Leer. Yes. Leer. And there. Just free up room. Free up room in our thing. Meh. 45 is a cell. Remember that. Contains dig. We. Uh, I don't want to get rid of it, though. Body slam. We'll keep that for... Snorlax, I guess. Alright, and now... HM45... Sell. Because eh, we don't need you. And Super Potions Galore. Alright, now we're gonna go heal our Pokemon. And continue on our journey of... Dilly -dee. Nope, it's not over here, it's up here. Bleh. The layout is hurting my brain. Did we talk to you? Yep, SSN Mord. Please heal my poor Pokemon. They were assaulted on the SSN. We'll quickly jump over to the right, see if there's anything on the right. Vermilion City, the port of exquisite sunsets. I'm putting up a building on this plot of land. My Pokemon is tamping the land. I was gonna, I, I wanted to look down and talk to the Pokemon. Machop, go all go go. A Machop is stomping the land flat. Well, now that that's out of the way, we can head back to the SSN with healed up Pokemans. It'd be hilarious if you get locked out of the SSN. But nope, I have a ticket. Welcome to the SSN. Excuse me, do you have a ticket? Flashed it like a baller. Now remember, go to the left and then pick up and go on a rampage. Luckily, I think we can explore it quite a lot, so we shouldn't have to worry about, oh, you did the thing, and now you must leave. Nope. You're just a normal dude. I think it was this one that had the Pokeball. Max Ether for Max PP Restoration. Hello, old man. Pokemon can cut down small bushes. Ah, uh, yes, I have some Pokemon. Fair, uh, seen Pokemon carry? Uh, yeah. I, my brain wants to get point across, but now it is messing up words. I've seen Pokemon ferry people across the water. Considering that my Clefairy can learn Bubble Beam and Water Gun, I'm going to assume it can learn Surf, too. Which do you like, a strong or a rare Pokemon? How about both? Gentleman wants to fight. Mankey. Kick it. Ah, uh, let's see. Seismic toss. Uh, didn't do that much. 
Of course you get a critical hit because you're a bastard. Switch to my beloved boy, Charmeleon. First, growl so that it can't do more damage. Well, it can still do damage, but it can't do as much damage. You know what? Do it once more. Fraction its power. Of course you get a crit because you're a terrible human being. Scratch it to death! Tear out its eyes! Probably should have leered, but eh, uh, we're already in the offense mode. You keep trying to lore, lore, still trying to roar. It's not working. Stop. A ponyta, huh? We'll have Pikachu deal with you so we can heal my Pokemon after this. Double team, raise your evasion. And now, Thundershock. Because as we all know, horses are weak to electricity. The natural predator of horses, lightning. Yeah, Pikachu a left there. I must salute you. And now to heal up my Pokemon again because I keep just getting them bashed in. And now you're gonna fight me too, aren't you? It's like Tetris, but with Pokemon trainers. I never saw you at the party. What, do you think I stole this ticket? Well, you're wrong. No! Quick! Seismic toss it into outer space! Ah, crap. Uh, karate chop! Crit it! Hit its eyes! Aha! Ah, it gave up singing. We made it angry. Crit it again with another karate chop. Why does it do so much crits? I hate it. Take it easy. You attacked me. Oh boy, another rare candy I'm gonna have to sell. Mm. And I have to start using my super heals. I have 20 of them, so it shouldn't be that bad. And since we're going to be running into Gary one of these days, yeah, heal up Pikachu too. Probably a waste, but uh, I'm a wasteful person. Have you gone to the Safari Zone in Fush... How do you even say that? Fush... Fushuz... Fuch... Fushia... Fushia? Fushizia? <laughs> Fushia City? It had many rare kinds of Pokemon. Me and my daddy think the Safari Zone is awesome. The child is played by Danny DeVito, don't worry. The captain looked really sick and pale. I hear many people get seasick, including the sea person. I think this is where uh, Gary comes out to assault us. In that case, I'm going to put Pikachu front and center to annihilate his Spiro. That'll probably be a Fero now. Hello, Gary, you bastard. Bonjour, Neon. Imagine seeing you here. Neon, were you really invited? How's your Pokedex coming? I already caught 40 kinds, pal. Different kinds are everywhere. Crawl around in grassy areas. Hell, yeah, he didn't act like an asshole this time. Ah, he has a different sprite. Huh, still a Spiro, and it's only one level higher. Die. Huh, it survived. How magical. Die. Torture it to death. 
Booyah, about to send out a Rattata? Well, guess what? My Mankey has something to say to your Rattata. Huh, I thought... I thought that your Rattata would have been a... Mega Punch is a normal move! I'm angry. But yeah, I thought your Rattata would have been Eradicate by now. Karate Chop. For insult on injury. About to send out Sandshrew, huh? Well, guess what? I have Ivasaur for that. At least I think Ivasaur is good against you. Vine Whip. Whip his Sandshrew. Quit scratching my vegetable salad! And now you're gonna send out your Eevee. Who should take on your Eevee? Hmm. Striker! Send attack in its eyes! Pocket sand! It won't do. It's already trying to allure you into a false sense of security. Pocket sand again! And now... Kill. Well, now that's just rude. Kill it quickly before it regains its eyes! Seriously, I want to know why Tail Whip is considered a defense-lowering thing. Is it, like, distracting you by smacking your face with its tail? Like a cat? Huh. At least you're raising your Pokémon. And now he gave me ten dollars. I heard there was a Cut Master on board, but he was just a seasick old man. But Cut itself is really useful. You should go see him. Smell ya! He walked into a wall. Can we look at the book? Captain- Ooh, I feel hideous! <laughs> Seasick! Rubbed the captain's back. Rub, 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 rub. The magical healing rub. Oh, thank you. I feel much better. You want to see my cut technique? I could show you if I wasn't ill. I know, you can have this. Teach it to your Pokémon, and you can use see it cut any time. We finally got it. And now, who to begin the HM Slaven? It contained cut. Of course you aren't able. Sorry, Ivasaur, you are going to be on the way. Honestly, I think Lee... Uh... Yeah, Leech Seed. It's the least useful, really. It has very minimal use, and it only takes a small amount of health and heals very little. It's kind of decent here or there, but... Eh. It's like, it kind of feels like a waste of a move, almost. You can probably save more health just by defeating the Pokémon faster than... <laughs> Like, you can save a turn, dealing more damage or lowering their attack with Growl. Our captain is a sword master. He even teaches cut to Pokemon. Are right, you gonna fight me? Ahoy there! Are you seasick? Why are you asking that, you monster? Sailor wants to fight. Thundershot. Paralyze his muscles. No, not the critical hit drop. I hate you. I hate karate chop. It chops me in half. About to send out a tentacle, huh? Hmm. Ivysaur! You can use some leveling up, so kill this squid. What? I was gonna say, 
Why is it not very effective? It's a bloody water type. It should be affected by grass. I hate you. Quit trying to hook my Ivasaur on ice. Uh, acid? Acid. I should probably have used Growl a while ago. Kill it. Kill it before it kills you. I was just careless. And time to heal with our super heals. One for Ivysaur. One for Pikachu. And who should go in first place now? I think Striker could use some more. Party's over. The ship will be departing soon. Hey, matey. Let's do a little jig. Is it the Himpin jig? I don't like that one. I forget. Is fighting... No, fighting's not good against air, but I don't have any air attacks. Mm -hmm, pocket sand. I make up. Oh, yeah. I forgot you have critical hit shot because I hate your soul. Pocket sand has not been useful. Pocket sand! It would be ironic if pocket sand missed. Alright, time to uh, use a super heal. Mm -mm -mm. Ah, the smell of cheating. Quick, use gust! You know, the wind based normal attack. I'm still on that. I hate it. I already explained why it is the way it is for early game uh, easing, but it's such an annoying quirk. I hate you. And it's not like we can run back to uh, the Pokemon Center. We have to do it now because... If we leave now, the SSN leaves. Now, Vine Whip. Yay, it's actually super effective this time. Why is Tentacool not affected by grass? It's very annoying. Good, I would have hated to have a confused Ivysaur. It's level 20! Yay! You're impressive. I know how to dance with Pokemon. Oh, da, 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 I forget. We'll have Luna do some stuff. And eh, I'll say stave off just in case. Scrubbing Dex is hard work. Oh, he's not going to fight me. Oof, I feel ill. I stepped out to get some air. I guess that's why he asked. It didn't look like... From here, you wouldn't see, think that this was, like, anywhere different. you think this is just another interior of the SSN. But no, it's actually the outside of the SSN. And now we can continue on our adventure of exploring the SSM. The SSSSSS. I think we already went down here. Yeah, that's to the kitchen, I believe. Now we'll go to the right, explore everywhere, dominate this entire place, submit myself as the Pokemon champion of the SSN. I found a Max Potion. I stole it from a poor Machoke. Let me go. My buddy Machoke is super strong. He has enough strength to move big rocks. You gonna fight me? You gonna beat me to death with your big arms? My sailor's pride is at stake. Why? Is it because I walked into your room? You're a weird man. He sent out a seahorse. Oh no. All right. Put it to sleep. 
Oh crap, it's Bubble Beam! It'll slow you down! Because bubbles! Well, growl. And now, double slap that horsey! Slap that horse! Slap it! Pound the horse! Ah, uh, goddammit, you should be damn it Quit bubbling my Clefairy! <laughs> huh, is there a difference between bubble beam and bubble? There has to be. Shelter, huh? You can survive! Especially when I use this super potion! I am the worst kind of trainer to fight in this world. Well, we can't have that. Put it to sleep! Quit withdrawing and fight me! And by that I mean quit withdrawing and go to sleep. While it's down, growl at it. Give it nightmares with a growl. And now, double slap time. How is a sleeping Pokemon faster than you? Of course you missed. You are an annoying anomaly. A CMM and ME. Put it to sleep. Don't let it withdraw anymore. We can't have that. The only withdrawal that I'll have you have is in your dreams. Pound. Pound. Pound the shell. Duh. It is an insomniac shelter, I'm guessing. Quit with... Well, I... Actually, you know what? You keep withdrawing. It just gives me more opportunity to kill you! It's gonna survive that, isn't it? Ah, oh, it didn't. Yay! You can take this one on, too. Sing to the fish. I hate you. It didn't affect, which just means that it missed. You are an annoying Pokemon. What I really should do... Yeah, but at the same time, if... It, it, if blah, 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 it's like, I'm trying to evaluate the logistics of using Growl before Sing. Why did you wake up? Actually, come to think of it, if I just pounded you this entire time, you would have died by now. I'm inefficient. Aha! Level up! Your pride is broken! <laughs> your spirit sank me! I sank your battleship! Better be thankful that this isn't the anime or that wouldn't be the only thing that's sinking! Alright, Pikachu, let's have you get some. Fight me! You know what they say about sailors and fighting! No! No, I don't! He only has one. I guess it's because it's a higher level, which is perfect for Pikachu. Kill it! Oh, you're one of them Pokemon trainers. Mm. He's just like me, for real. Because he's an annoying Pokemon trainer. Confusing my Pikachu, how dare you? My Pikachu is confused as it is. Alright, good fight, mate. He only had one Pokemon ball, I had six. I'm a bully! You're not gonna take my Pokeball. I like feisty kids like you. Whoa, 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 whoa. Bad touch. Bad touch. And for that bad touch, we're gonna electrocute all your Pokemon to death. Thundershock! And a critical hit at that. This is Pokemon Critical Hit Edition.
You stay in there. We're power leveling Pikachu today. Mainly because uh, cutting up the experience between Pokemon re is really inefficient at this level. Because it just means that, like, if they were a lower level Pokemon, like, 15 or something, that would be one thing. But they're all, like, the same level of 18 to 20. So there's no real point in uh, doubling up the experience between Pokemons. Arg! I lost it! And now uh, the FBI is going to come for you. Oh boy, I found an ether. Hmm. I'm not sure if I'll ever need one, but I want to... Uh, it's that thing. I, I, I worry that I will need them. Our sailors have Pokemon too! Ah, we're in the crew quarters. That explains it. Nuke that tentacool. Be cruel to that tentacool so that it becomes tentacruel. How dare you. How dare you. Let my little blob boy go. So that he can kill you. Ah, star you. This is the second one we've seen. And he's upside down. But not that effective because he's just like, hey, I'm gonna attack you. And then he died. Bye bye, Sailor Man. Okay, you're not bad. Hi. Huh, you'd think that in the Pokemon world, TM44, you'd think that in the Pokemon. <laughs> You're thinking that... <laughs> I don't know why, but just cutting myself off to say TM44 was amusing. But back on track, you'd think that, uh... <laughs> well, that's going to Snorlax as well. You'd think that the Pokemon world, they'd have, uh... Nurse Joys on hand on these kind of things. Hello, stranger, stop and chat. All my Pokemon are from the sea. And that's why I'm gonna murder them with my Pikachu. He tried to kill me. Kill it. Quit trying to hook my Pokemon on drugs. Booyah! Pikachu is leveling hard. About to send out a star, you, huh? Ivasaur. How about you get some easy leveling in? Although, hey, maybe we'll have to use one of my ethers to give your Vine Whip back. How dare you. Kill him with Vine Whip. You should probably be able to take him out with a tackle. And watch him survive, because the game... <gasps> A shelter, eh? Kill him. Scoop out the jelly-filled insides with your vines. Yay! Murder. Darn, I let that one get away. Me? You mean me? Me? You're talking about me? I'm the one that got away? Why are you being creepy, old man? Hmm. And I won't do it just yet. I'll actually have... I'll risk Charmeleon a bit, because... Eh, I want him to get some levels. Matey, you're walking the plank if you lose. Oh, so you're giving me a death threat. Mm. Ah, this is the perfect matchup. All right, Charmeleon. First growl so that he does less damage. Crap. We're gonna have to double up. Because fucking crits. I hate you. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ on a crisp cracker. Luckily, 
I'm a little dirty cheater. I hate you. Scratch him! Let's risk it. Give him a leer. And because I'm paranoid and I have lots of money. Actually, I don't know how much money I have. Hmm. Well, at least he went away from using the annoying ability. Crit chop. And now he's just spamming by kicking my shins. Quit trying to kick my shins. I'm going to burn you. And now he's back to critting. Mm. You can kill him! It would be hilarious if he missed. Yes. Ah, beaten by a kid that you threatened to throw overboard. Asshole. And that's it. We completed the SSN. And poor Charmeleon just got beat up by Karate Crit. And I will say it again. One, why is Karate Chop a normal move? And two, why it doesn't get crits so much? It hurts my soul. La 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 la. And now the SSN is SS gone. And now, I guess what I could do is go back to Cerulean, I think it is. And, uh, well, first we're going to sell our, uh, our candy, because I don't want to use the candy. It's like the principle of the matter. I'm weird. Shut up. Ah, we actually are pretty rich. And we're going to buy a decent amount of super heals. And now we're going to heal up our Pokemon, go back, get a bike. And uh, then head to Lavender Town. Because I think that's the only place we can go right now. I think. Wait, we can fight Surge! We can fight Lieutenant Surge! We've got cut! But do we have anything that's actually good against electric Pokemon? Not really. We don't have any super effectiveness. I don't have any rocks. But it's okay. We can take them down. I forgot you actually have to go into the fucking thing and use it. <laughs> cut. I fixed your front lawn, Surge. Give me money. And it means that I get a water type Pokemon at long last. Hell yeah, if I win this. Hello, boy. Yo, champ in the making. Lieutenant Surge has a nickname. People refer to him as the Lightning American. He's an expert on electric Pokemon. Birds and water Pokemon are at risk. Beware of paralysis, too. Lieutenant Surge is very cautious. You'll have to break a code to get to him. Nope, there's nothing but trash here. Nope, there's nothing but trash here. Pikachu, please. Nope, there's nothing but trash here. Let's... Uh, da -da. Nope, there's nothing but trash here. Hey, there's a switch under trash. Turn it on. The first electric lock opened. And now, time to fight. This is no place for kids. I have two badges. And I'm gonna poke them into your eye. Why are you a sailor with an electric type? You're a filthy liar, liar. Liar, liar. Karate chop! The critical hits. Oh, yeah, I forgot. You have Sonic Boom. Fuck. I forgot you like to do tons of damage with your Sonic Booms. Hello, Guile. From... Drot Futter? Well, luckily, I have the ultimate cheat. I can heal my Pokemon mid-battle, and you're a poor person. 
so you can't. <laughs> My minky has survived ye. Wow, surprised me. Nope, there's trash under here. Hey, the electric locks were reset. Do they move? Holy shit, they move. I wonder if they give me a hint if I kill them all. I'm in a lightweight, but I'm good with electricity. Ah, he's a rocker. Party Rock is in the house tonight. Karate chop him! But it failed. Break him. Break his balls. I think, is that the attack or the yeah, greatly fell? But it won't give him a chance to attack. Waha. Another vault up, huh? Go, Charmeleon! Growl! If he uses that sonic boom attack, it's gonna be all over. Alright, now finish him off with a leer. And now set that vault orb alight! Status moves are actually really good. Take that, younger me. Ah, and now he's burned too. Scratch him. How dare you. He got a critical hit too, and he killed himself with the burn. Wah, -huh, wah, -huh. another Voltor, man. Eh? Growl. Of course you. Oh, I forgot. It was like uh, he, he must have gotten a a a crit. No, that's just the normal attack when he's not affected by growl yet. <laughs> Growl again! And... Dang it, I... I meant to... For some reason my brain's like, Oh, it defaults to a normal. Eh? Well, that's a decent amount of damage. Ah, uh, fuck, there's a sonic boom. Well, that's a decent amount of damage. But we ain't risking your dune. Because I've got money, I can pay for more of these. Quick! Kill him! Good, he didn't use Sonic Boom. That would have hurt. Maybe not kill ya. Well, we... He's very bad. He's bad. He's bad. Fried! And let's have uh, Ivasaur maybe get in here some. When I was in the army, Lieutenant Surge was my strict CO. Gentleman wants to Growl! <laughs> boy. Well, that's not good. Now, tackle! What the hell?! That's very rude! And no experience was gotten there either. Ah, so you're a plum punk, aren't ya? I'm gonna turn your Pokemon to sleep and then I'm gonna punch them in their sleep. You're an asshole! 
Come on, sing him to sleep. Sing him to sleep. I swear if you get a crit, I'm going to punch your eye. <laughs> ah, so he can just use a self-destruct, but I can't even put him to sleep. Put to sleep. Why is he faster than me? How dare he? Finally! Kill. Fast as slop. It's, one of, it's another one of those moments where probably if I had just attacked him from the start, he would be dead by now. But he's just like, I wanted to smack him about while he was asleep. All right, we'll talk to all of them, see if they give me any hints. The door won't open. Lieutenant Surge always was cautious. Okay, I'll talk. Lieutenant Surge said he hit his door switches inside something. No, duh. Lieutenant Surge said double locks. Here's a hint. When you open the first lock, the second lock is right next to it. So that's kind of easy. Now we just gotta leave. Heal up our Pokemon. Luckily, even while he's knocked out, he can still use Cut. Don't know how that works, but hey, Pokemon. It's like, if you're like, we need our electricity fixed, but Bill, our electricity guy is dead. Ah, bring him in anyway. And then the corpse just fixes your electricity. Pokemon Necromancy. That reminds me that apparently the Pokemon manga can get surprisingly dark at times. Or depressing. Sometimes both. Alright, now that we beat up all the dudes, we just need to look around and then it'll be right next to it. Nope, there's only trash here. Darn, that would have been the perfect one, too. I'm going to try both the top ones first in hopes that I only have a very limited selection. Well, actually, no, that wouldn't work. It's not process of elimination, really. Of course it's in the middle somewhere. Switch on the trash, turn it on. The second electric opened, yay! It really was right next to it. All right, we're gonna do this true cannon. Pikachu, beat up this man. What's in your trash can? Nope, only trash. Crammed full of Pokemon books. Tin Hut, welcome to Vermilion City. Well, will you look at that, a pint-sized challenger. <laughs> You've got big brassy nerves to take me on with your puny power. A Pokemon battle is war. I'll show you, civilian. I'll shock you into surrender. Ah, he's gonna torture us. What is with everyone threatening the child? He only has one Pokemon. And it's level 28. Oh, God. Double team! Ah, uh huh. I'm not the only one that can cheat. Double team! Fuck. I got two off, so that's something. Now, Super Potion! How did it hit? I had to evade up. I'll have to miss one of these times. Double team again!
And now, quick attack! Your X speed ain't worth nothing here! My Pikachu doesn't even need to be a Raichu to beat your Chew, Rai! No! Pikachu! He got punched! And it was fucking crit! I hate crits! Ah! Crits are so annoying in this goddamn game. I am really annoyed by them. And I'm gonna lose now, because all my Pokémon are low level. Because fuck you with your crits, you asshole. Uh, I get crits because I'm an asshole. Hey, maybe use Growl. But it's just like super annoying that crits are in this game so freaking often. Oh no, you don't get to have actually a fight. It's more like praying to R in Jesus. Why? <laughs> you already had a one hit kill because of your fucking crits. Because you're a fucking asshole. And let me guess, one hit kill? Wow, that's a lot less damage. It's just super annoying that crits are in this game so much. If only because you have a limited selection of moves. And then I guess a crit? No. Oh, you don't feel like doing crits now, huh, Billy? Yeah, crits in this game really annoy me. Oh, and he also does Mega Kick. Wow, it didn't even level up my... my Avisor. Whoa! You're the real deal, kid! Fine then, take the Thunder Badge. The Thunder Badge cranks up your Pokemon's speed. It also lets your Pokemon fly anytime, kid. You're special, kid. Take this. TM24! Let me guess, Thunderbolt? Contains Thunderbolt. Teach it to you an electric Pokemon. Once I heal up Pikachu, we'll go heal, throw one of our Pokemon into storage, so that we can have Squirtle. I don't know who I'll throw in. Maybe Striker. Yeah, probably Strike. No, no, not, not Striker. Bleh. Probably Mankey. But yeah. Crits in this game are just annoying me now. Because they happen way too freaking often. It just kind of is very annoying to play the game. And only to have 5 billion crits every single match. Crits are supposed to be a random thing that happens once in a while, like a 1 in a 100 thing. Maybe 1 in 50. Not 1 in 2. And now we can have our beloved boy, Squartle. Alright, sorry, Menke. We're gonna have... Our boy, and we're gonna give him Bubble Beam and Water Gun, depending on what moves he already has. That'll fully- oh yeah, I forgot! Hey, Pikachu! We're gonna replace that diddly D. Yes. Thundershock, because it's just... Paralysis guaranteed, but Thunder. Thunderbolt. Super nice. You have the Thunder Badge? You must be a good trainer. I just caught a Squirtle that was always getting into mischief. Would you take good care of it? Yes. Did you want to give it a nickname? Nah, it'll be just Squirtle. Please treat Squirtle right. Alright, Squirtle. Level 10. So we're going to have to bump you up. Bubble and Tackle and Tail Whip. Alright. First thing first. Let's see. It contained Water Gun. Squirtle. 
And then let's find Bubble Beam. And we'll replace Bubble with it. Because I think maybe it's good? <laughs> yes. Bubble Beam, and we'll keep Tail Whip. And now we will put Squirtle in top position as we head back to get a bike and head to Lavender Town. Let's see what level the fight is at the very least, see if he can maybe take it on his own. Five levels higher, doubt it. All right. Pikachu, we have new toys, don't we? Use Thunderbolt! Just Annihilate. Kind of wish that you could get Squirtle a bit earlier. Just so that you could, you know actually level up your Pokemon with the trainers that are around? I still don't have a Cubone for you. And even if I did, I wouldn't give it to you. Ooh, and we can cut our way in. Alright, Ivysaur, cut our way in. I wish that these would stay gone, though. Wait. Oh yeah, we need the, we, we came here for the bike. Doo -doo -doo. Doo -doo -doo. I have a bike voucher. Oh, that's a bike voucher! Okay, here you go. I didn't do the bike exploit. Hey, let's talk to people. Hey, talk to me. Talk to me. A plain city bike is good enough for me. You can't put a shopping basket on an MTB. Wow, your bike is really cool. And now, I can ride my bike everywhere. Ride my bike around the square. Bike, bike, bike. Bike, bike, bike. Wait, uh, can you, uh, favorite an item? I, I, for some reason, I want to say that you could favorite an item. Got on the bike. Do do do. Going slightly faster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I can cut my way in. I've a sore go ahead and boom. Boom, boom. You have a Pokemon with you. You're mine. That's creepy. Please don't be high level. Like they don't expect you to come back with the bike. You have a lot of Pokemon. Well, uh, you're kind of even our level. And you're prime pickings for Charmeleon. Of course you would. You... Ember! I probably should have done... L actually, eh, it kind of evens out to do Leer and then Ember at this point because then it would still be two rounds to do the same thing. Knock out the Pokemon. Action economy! Da, 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 da. Ah, he leveled two. About to use Bellsprout? Don't worry. Squirtle, go on out there so you can experience this. And then uh, throw out... The boy. Charmeleon. And once again, it's probably going to be the same thing where there's no real point in doing Leer because it's just trying to get it to the point that the Bell Sprout will just uh, get. Uh... Maybe Growl would have been nice. But it's all about the action economy. Trying to use as little moves as possible to knock out the enemy Pokemon.
And since I have... Like, if I didn't have type advantage, I'd probably want to do growl and leer. God damn it. If you do rep, I'm gonna be angry. Okay, you did growl because you're stupid. Die. About to use another oddish. Throw out Squirtle. And uh, let's get Striker some experience. He doesn't have any air attacks still, but he should be uh, resistant to grass attack. Quick, sand attack! Pocket sand! And now, quick attack. Why are you trying to poison all my Pokemon? Are you a, a rabid poisoner? Is that your job? For some reason, I'm now reminded of a thing. I forget what. It was a game. There's a game where if you... Oh, yeah. Uh, what is it? Uh, Middle Earth Shadow of War. Where if you poison uh, a drink... There's a chance that the poisoner will show up and be like, That's not how you poison something! Just random bits of memory flooding back. And now, pocket sand! Oh no, the plant has sand in its eyes. Oh no! Not sleep powder, you bastard. Now I'm the one on the end of the pain. And it's just raising its special. Oh no. But it missed. It's like, it missed so bad it cries and decides to grow its power instead. And now it's dead. You deceived me, how? And now I gotta go back and heal my Pokemon, cause you poisoned him! Sure, I might be a jerk for using a team of six Pokemon, and using advanced strategies to beat people up, but at least I don't poison Pokemon. Cause that's just cruel. To use poison powder and poison attacks in a casual Pokemon fight. Yeah, I swore you could be able... Maybe it's later games where you're able to take, like, your bicycle and be like, I can instant use this. Wait, uh, we want to go this way so that we don't have to go through the house and put our bicycle back on. A lot of quality of life stuff is added in later games. Being able to just click A on, like, trees and rocks that you want to use HM moves on. So you don't have to go into the menu to do each time. It's probably a programming limitation, and I'm gonna save. Because we're gonna head to the rock cave. I want that item. TM30. What is TM30? TM30. Teleport. I don't have... Do I? Luna's able. But I'm not sure if I want to get rid of anything. It's pound, sing, double slap, and growl, I think. And I think tele... But at the same time, teleport's a nice go back. Actually, never mind. I talked myself into it, because I think... I don't think it's a, uh... Growl. Easy. Yes, it's a nice move, but teleport, man! Teleport! Now I can go back to the last, uh... Center that I was at. Bah, great! I was bored, eh? Yeah, because I think that's what it is. You can go back to the last Pokemon Center you healed at. 
Uh, I was hoping that you were gonna be a, gr a rock type that I could super effect. But even then, it would probably be extra mean. Go! It's a fighting type! Oh, but you're gonna use Karate Chop, aren't you? Yeah. Okay, good. I was gonna get extra angry. Oh, it's still good. Sand attack! Pocket sand! I hate Karate Chop! Why do you have Karate Chop? Karate Chop! I hate you! Koa. Doo doo. Karate Chop, I hate you. Go home to your dojo. Jojo? Because it's just. It's such an inconsistent move, Karate Chop is. Because either it crits and does a, quite a bit of damage, or it doesn't, in which case it's just like, why? <laughs> And not to mention, again, it's a normal move. An onyx, huh? Let's hope. Will it be enough? Tail whip. Ah, it actually didn't do that much. Tail whip. Alright, that's very bad. Bubble beam! Man, you're you're gonna be mean to my squirtle. Booyah! And that's why I did that. Risking my poor squirtle's life. Keep it coming, eh? Oh wait, I'm out of Pokemon! <laughs> Let's see. Yeah. Teleport! Warp to the last Pokemon Center. <laughs> Booyah! That is going to be so freaking helpful. I had to give up Growl, which would be super helpful on its own as well, because it's an actual tactical thing. But hey, that's why I have Sing. That's what Sing is for. <laughs> Instead of making them do damage, I make them do no damage unless I keep missing. And now I'm just like, now that I'm super into Pokemon again, I'm gonna have to go watch like the Pokemon movies and maybe even the anime. Because my brain is like, hey, make a Pokemon fan fiction, but I have to work on my art and stuff. I have to work on my art, make a VTuber model eventually, if only for the experience. I have to look. No, it's just a dude down here. Ha <laughs> ha Come on, dude! Let me guess, you have Geodudes up the wazoo, don't you? Wow, would you look at that? Tail Whip! Seduce that Geodude. Do it one more time, and then we'll use Bubble Beam! Ah, well, kind of evened out. Bubble beep. Haha. <laughs> Good job, Squirtle. The experience is all yours. Ah, he's about to send out an onyx. Quick, tail whip. Oh, fuck. Oh, actually, that's not that bad. I would swap things out. But I don't want uh, the experience to be shared. All right, bubble beam. Please don't do a lot of damage. Uh, yeah, good. Booyah! Note to self: one tail whip is generally decent, apparently. Haha, <laughs> you beat me fair. Squirtle's evolving! Booyah! War turtle time! Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do
Hell yeah. Only downside about being on a bike. I can't ask Pikachu what they think. Route 9, Cerulean City, Rock Tunnel. Fight me. I aim to be the ultimate trainer. I aim to crush your dreams. Small child. Alright. I probably should have healed, but... Bubble Beam! Please don't kill. Ah, Bubble Beam! Just power level in my dude. Feed my war turtle more, small child. My Sanshu lost? You're goddamn right. Alright, time to teleport back to the last Pokemon Center to heal up my war turtle. Because now that I have that, I don't have to do potions as much. I can use potions purely in combat. Or if I just am really annoyed at uh, random encounters, but then I can... I don't know. I don't know. Should I get Repel? Hmm. Pondering the ponders. Pondering my orb-like Pikachu. The one downside to the bicycle. I can't converse with my Pikachu. But we can move so fast. So fast. So furious. Oh yeah, here's another thing I can talk about. Kind of out of the blue, but one time, uh, me and my family were just watching YouTube. Go suit my super bug Pokemon. And we got basically a two minute uncut action scene from the new Kingsman movie that's coming out. And it's just mad. That they're just like, lolly lol, random, no, it didn't have the title, it didn't have anything, it was literally just a scene from the movie, and for some reason, all it had at the end was 20th Century Fox. It didn't have the name of the movie or anything, so I was just like, because the action scene actually looked really good, so I'm like, what the hell is this? So, I basically googled 20th Century Fox... Ah, I should have... Oh, I'll, I'll just kill you. 20th Century Fox Russian <laughs> ad. Or something like that. I, just, I forget what I actually put it. Blech. And we'll throw War Turtle out again. I forgot because I was just spamming through the buttons. I want to say bug Pokemon are decent against water. I don't know. My ability to tell is crack. And your ability to live is dead. Haha, if it disabled my ember, I would have been upset. Bug catcher is dead. My bugs! I crushed your bugs. Your bugs are dead. I'm taking Rock Tunnel to go to Lavender. Why'd you talk like that? Why do you look like a person when you're a boy? Ah, now the real question is, who's decent against normal types now? Hey Pikachu, how about you take this one? Because Mankey was my go-to slam the normal types to death. Thunderbolt! Booyah! It was a critical hit to boot. Gonna send out a Diglett? I won't even have to change out, War Turtle. Let's try something a bit different. War Turtle, use Water Gun! You... Bitch! 
Hey, you want to play this stupid game? Surprise! I was gonna give you a chance, but no, you're just like, I'm gonna use Dig! So I'm like, fine! You wanna do that? I'm gonna send out my, my Pidgeotto, boy, because I hate you! Gonna use an Ekans. I will send out Squirtle. Or not, he evolved. It's War Turtle now. <laughs> but yeah, because I do not appreciate that. Granted, it probably wouldn't have done that much because it was freaking diddly dee. Eh, Striker could actually use some leveling too. You use Leer? I use Pocket Sand! Yeah. Now the snake's eyes. He can't even see. Pocket Sand. Drown him in sand. <laughs> sand in the eyes. Sand in the eyes. <laughs> ah, he still gets a rap. And it didn't last that long, huh? And then the Ekans died. Ah! Ah! Yeah, that was a double level. Yay! Sand Shrew? Now, you've, unless you have freaking, freaking, freaking dig too. Or are you just gonna use Fly to spite me? Water gun. Nah, it didn't kill you. Why'd you get a critical? Pokemon Critical Hit Edition. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Can't measure up. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Ah, let's go ahead and teleport back because we don't need no <laughs> potions right now. Whee! I'm so happy that I decided to catch a Clefairy and have the Clefairy on hand and be like, I'm, you're gonna be my normal type. Even though it can't learn cut, which is slightly annoying. So I have to, poor Venusaur has to become my HM slave to a degree. I'm probably going to have to do the inefficient thing and spread my HMs across my party. But I think I've always kind of done that in the past. All right, Ivysaur. Cut that shrubbery. A shrubbery! Shrubbery. I wonder what the actual definition of, like, a shrub is. Instead of just, oh, piece of plant. Small plant. Because this says, like, rock tunnel, right? Route 9, Cerulean City Rock Tunnel. Let's experience things. I got up early every day to raise my Pokemon from cocoons. Oh boy, Charmeleon's gonna eat good today. Ah, it's the first time we see that abomination. Now, let's try it out. I'm scared. Beedrill's getting pumped. Use Bubble Beam! Fury attack. I think this attacks a lot. Yep. Only two times, though. Yay! Tail Whip again! Because Fury attack's not doing that much, so, uh, hopefully it's, uh, focus power does it. Oh, but it failed. <laughs> How do you fail at waving your tail, unless it actually is about seduction? Fury attack, stop. Fury attack, no fury. Water gun. It tried to focus, but it failed. It's me, for real. This is a comedy of errors. 
How many times is it going to go today? Only two. Yay. No focus for you. You dead. Booyah. Eh, another bee drill. Are you joking? Charmeleon, burn this bee drill into... Go ahead and leer. So that the super effect will be ever so slightly more effective. And now, Ember. God damn it, you survived. I really do wonder what the most effective way is, if, like, leer into a super effective attack is worth anything. Or if it's just better to do two super effective attacks in a row. Yay. What? What a total waste of time. Don't talk down to your Pokemon like that, you little shit. Oh, it just leads to a patch of grass. Probably for, like, catching Pokemon. What other- what random Pokemon are in here? There has to be a reason for this to be a place. Nope, it's just a need to read it. Me. Bubble Beam. Ah, speed did fell. I guess, I wonder if Bubble is, like, more guaranteed to lower speed, whereas Bubble Beam is a stronger attack overall, but has a lesser chance of lowering speed. I don't know. I am not a Pokemon Master. I'm just decent at the game, I guess. I haven't whited out yet. <laughs> that has to count for something. button, but it's me. Ah, I guess I could save too. At this rate, we'll probably try to get through the rock tunnel into Lavender Town. Actually, uh, we'll go by the, st the store. We'll stop by the shop. Oh, wait, but they don't have any super potions. Actually, uh, the other town isn't that far away. All things considered. So, Ibisaur, cut. Yeah, all things considered, the other town that sells super potions isn't that far away. So we're gonna go buy some super potions. Can I super bike? Yay! Take that, Professor Oak. You can't tell me where to ride my bicycle in this tunnel. We ain't got time for Pokemon battles. The only downside to actually entering and exiting stuff is the white flash. That's annoying. like to buy some super potions. I will go with 12. Also, the downside of using the bike, I can't hear the wonderful music. Mm. 
Do do do. Hopefully, in later games, the white flashes will be toned down, because I don't know how to deal with that. Like this. Yeah, like, if, if the white flashes were on, oddly enough, if the flashes of white were on for longer, it actually would be better. <laughs> well, on we go. Fight me, probably Rockman. Ha ha ha, aren't you a little toughy? Bad touch? Hello, dude, I'm going to bubble beam your Geodude right into your face. I love power leveling my starters. Booyah! Take that, Gary! I'm a chopper. Now that we're at a kind of even level... Striker! Oh yeah, I forgot you're gonna use Karate Chop because it's a normal attack! <laughs> I hate it. Not very effective! It did over half damage! Critical hits! <sighs> I'm still annoyed that freaking karate chop is normal. This Machop must just have a high base attack. Jesus Christ. I'm a higher level than it, and it's doing massive damage with inefficient attacks. About to send out a Geodude? Squirtle can take this. Actually, Ivasaur... Uh, yeah, let's do Ivasaur. He, he's probably decently close to leveling up. It's nice to give Ivasaur something to do. Vine Whip! Critical hit at that. Booyah! Ivasaur is trying to lose, uh, learn Poison Powder. Uh... Let's see, what, what attacks do we have? Growl lowers attack. Honestly, poison powder isn't worth it, in my opinion. God dang it. No. Abandon? Yes. What's that? I beat you. I beat your ass like a drum. Don't you dare condescend me! Well, now that's all I want to do. Small child. Ah, oh. Ah, uh, tail whip. Ow. But he has a shell! Bubble beam! Of course he would use growl. But I have bubble beam! All right, it's a critical hit. Now tackle. Growl all you want. My war turtle has the real power. Oh, that's not good at all. <laughs> Meowth on its deathbed. I'm gonna growl at you. No, you're too much. <gasps> oh yeah. Oh, we don't have Surf, but I think this leads to the power plant, and we can't go there yet. Oh, hey, a Pokemon Center! Yay! Talk to the people. I sold a useless nugget for 5,000! Hey, I did too! I heard that ghosts haunt Lavender Town. Well, he's not wrong. The element types of Pokemon make them stronger than some types and weaker than others. Unless you're Psychic. I don't think anything beats Psychic in Generation 1. Do, 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 
I wonder if there's, like, a Pokemon fan mod that, like, ties all the regions together. That would be kind of cool. If only so that you can go, like, from one place to one, uh... I forget the word, but, like, one game land to another keeping your team. I've been to a Pokemon gym a few times, but I lost each time. Why haven't you gone back to Pewter? You could probably have a decent team if you're here. Jigglypuff. Ah, I think I see now. Tail Whip! Seduce that Jigglypuff. I think it's working. Bubble Beam! Darn you! My beloved Bubble Beam! Tackle it! Give me back my Bubble Beam, you bastard! A Clefairy, huh? Let's have a Clefairy on Clefairy battle! Who is the real battler here? Sing for me, my angel of music! Can't wait till- ah! Sing again! Stay asleep this time so I can pound you in your sleep. But I can't wait for my Clefairy to learn Metronome, or is that not a thing yet? I don't know generational differences that much. It, all I know is just, like, special attack and stuff. Bleh. I used to have this information. Aha, it didn't affect me. I'm too busy smacking you. I'm smacking you. You tried to growl when I only need to hit you once more to win you. I. Oh, blew it again. I mean, it's not like I'm a gym leader. Even though I might as well be. Let's save out here because, oh boy, we're going into a cave. A cave. Oh no. Was, uh, I knew it. <laughs> Where's Flash? I am legitimately going to look up where Flash is. Because I don't really want to do... Deal with it. <laughs> it's like, the moment that I stepped into the cave, I'm like, wait a minute, Flash is a thing. I got to find that flesh. Let's see, what cave is this? Rock Tunnel. We want to go through Diglett. We want to go through the Diglett Cave. Which means we are in the wrong place entirely, but hey, we got a bunch of uh, easy... trainer battles in, so that counts for something. Yes, I know, it's kind of a bit cheatsy to look up where Flash is, but this is Generation 1, and I am not dealing with no dang darn caves that are very annoying. No, I know I'm not. <laughs> Basically, I'm just trying to ease myself and, like, potential viewers, because do you want to look at a black screen? <laughs> For long periods of time, I don't. I is tired right now at night. Merry Christmas as well. Hello in Indemin. And Merry Christmas to ya. He's very good Christmas. Even when Amazon is like, hey, have European copies of video games. At least they're still in English. Alright, gotta make our way to Diglett to try and get Flash so that we don't suffer darkness. Uh, 
I refuse to suffer darkness for longer than I have to. Even though technically flash doesn't make much sense in sense, because you'd think that you'd just be like, hey, have something that lights on entirely for quite a while, not singular. Aha! Fool! Flash! It's like throwing a flashbang into a cave and then suddenly the cave is lit up for eternity. You'd think the move would be called, like, Flare, but then that would be more like a, a fire attack. Hm. I keep ruining the music. Well, to the Diggly Cave we go, because... Oh well, yeah, because, uh... Snorlax is here and we can't get it yet. We could fight these dudes. Could you potentially run someone or Pokemon over with a bicycle? Sadly, no. That would be kind of funny. Let's go, but don't cheat. How do you cheat in this game? I guess Game Genie, but I don't have one. Hello, youngster. What level is your Pokemon? Level 21, eh? But that would be funny if you, like, ran about with your... <laughs> bicycle and just, like, knocked a trainer over so you don't have to fight them. Hey, get back here! Of course you poisoned my dear beloved! <laughs> Sing the snake to sleep. Sing the snake to sleep. Sing my angel of music. And now it's gonna wake up in one turn. <laughs> Team Rocket are getting run over again. <laughs> that would be hilarious. <laughs> I hate you, Ekans. Stay asleep. Or is this one of those moments where I need to just be like, yeah, well, that's... Well, that's a wrap. <laughs> I am mucho angry. Why must you rap so hard, you backward snake? Very rude. Triple rude. Okay, I'm gonna thunderbolt you to hell, Ekans. Thunder. Bolt. Bye bye, Ekans. You annoyed me, and now you are dead. Now I gotta go heal. Because it did say that there's a. Snorlax that's asleep in the way and you have to go through Diglett Cave to get around but yeah I'm gonna fight some dudes fight some trainers level up my Pokemon since they're at a kind of a decent level for this area yes bicycle bicycle Want to fight me, old man? Win, lose, or draw! Be gone, serpent, for you don't deserve a place in heaven, but only darkness, fire, and suffering. Indeed. Oh, it's a gambler man. Okay. Poliwag, huh? You'll be easy pickings for my... Ivasaur. How dare you try to hypnosis my beloved... Salad. Why does this guy kind of look like the last airbender? <laughs> he kind of does. About to use horsey, huh? Hey, Luna, try to avenge yourself. All right, first one sing. And now, all out defense, knock it to back to sea! Horsey! Pound that horse. 
until it is water. You woke up too late and now you will die. Crap, you have one health. And now, the one health horsey is horse dead. Meanwhile, my Clefairy alien is now level 21. Achcha! Didn't go my way. He kind of does look like a... <laughs> Give him the outfit he really would look like Aang. Or an airbender, at least. Competition! I can't get enough! I used to have a level 50 Grinning or Ninja Frog type of Pokemon. Yeah, the Greninja. Another gambler. Out to eat my soul. You're fine pickings for my Charmeleon. Ember. Yeah, and it burned him too. Yay. Of course you would, because you're an asshole. One is burned, one is poisoned. The perfect sitcom. Ah! By trying to grow, he burned himself to the ground. Ah, he faced burnout. Haha, <laughs> that's me. An oddish, eh? Ah, I don't wanna, don't wanna split my leveling too much. To be honest, you should sign up for some type of voice acting. I'm trying. I keep t people keep saying it. I'm trying to get roles, but it is difficult. You need to get your foot in the door. You need to do things. Have your voice be recognized. <laughs> but once I become a VTuber, I will truly be recognized as a voice actor, obviously. I had a chance. We all have a chance, Billy. We all have a chance, and you blew it. My Pokemon should be ready by now. But did you cook them in the oven? Small child. Youngster wants to fight, but I don't. And that's just it, the end. Bubble beam! How dare you kick my war turtle. He's my war turtle. My turtle of war! Ah, another Pokemon. Striker. Quick, pocket sand! You might be an evolved Pokemon, but you can't fight the power of pocket sand! It is sand in your eyes! Ha 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 ha. Ah, critical hit at that! Your horn missed. You have to be able to aim your horn because it is in your eyes. Eye horns. I think I'm starting to hallucinate from lack of sleep. Well, that's not good at all. You really should get some shut eye. And if you do, rest well, my dude. Too much, too young. Phrasing, dear boy. Fight me. I just became a trainer, but I think I can win. No, you can't. Because I am God. <laughs> Insomnia is pain. True that. Insomnia is definitely agony. Bye bye, Sand Shrew. You're dead. Send out a Zuban, eh? Let's see. Who should we send out? Ivasaur. Quick, use Vine Whip. Whip it good. Ah, it's not effective. Darn you. Don't you eat my salad. Quit trying to eat my salad. Ah. 
And now we are stuck in this eternal loop. But only one of us can win, and that winner will be me. If only because if things get really bad, I can always heal my Pokemon unless you get a crit. My Pokemon couldn't. You're right. They couldn't. And now time to teleport back. Hopefully this doesn't send me all the way <laughs> back back. What are Pokemon made of? Are they all skin and bone or something else? Since they can get very small and ball. Well, the ball is technology. They're all flesh and bone. Like Cubone. It's just that through the power of technology, we can put them into balls, trade them over the internet and stuff. It's m like a modern fantasy in a way, where the fantasy is kind of magical creatures and kind of super technology, but still mostly normal. The world of Pokemon's a little weird. I mean, in the uh, manga, Pokemon straight up do become skeletons, and we have fossils in this game, like Dom Fossil. So they are flesh and blood. Blood and flesh. Although I have no idea what the, like, skeleton of a Geodude would look like. It is just rock, but it's also a living thing. Pokemon are weird. I have never won before. That's just sad. <laughs> So is there an updated version of kidnapping in Pokemon? Eh, funnily, the... I forget certain things, but... Kind of catching a Pokemon in a Pokeball is kind of theft prevention in a way. But then there's also Team Rocket that's, like, trying to steal Pokemon. <laughs> so, yeah, Things. Hmm, Vulpix. Let's try and level up Striker. Hello there, Vulpix. Send attack in your eyes! A kidnapper would just say, hey, toddler, get in my balls. And it doesn't work on people. Not sure why, just... Meh. World of Pokemon. That would be a very interesting plotline. Pokeballs made for people. <laughs> Pokeballs are people. Pokeballs are people. But I mean, there is the... Uh, I saw this coming. Yeah, you came up to me and said you've never won. And then you lost. Kind of makes sense. But there is the theory thing that people are Pokemon to a degree, but yeah. Careful, I'm laying down some cables. Are these what these are? Cables? <laughs> but it would be hilarious if it did. True. The electrician wants to fight. But I don't. I shall send out Ivasaur. Oh boy, Sonic Boom, my favorite! I hate you. Have you heard of the Pokemon who kidnapped a child? There are many of those. There's, uh, what's his name? The evolution of, uh, Drowsy. Then there's the Driftloon. And there's probably more. The world of Pokemon can get surprisingly dark. Vine Whip! Whip it good. Growl again. Lower its attack until it is but an inch. Ah, <laughs> and now I'm gonna tackle you. <laughs> Tackling a metal ball. This is why I keep super potions handy. <laughs> I hate suicidic berm. How do you say that magmite is flesh and bone? I don't know. It is. It has to be. Because it's alive. Then there's Porygon. Pokemon are weird. 
That was electric. Is it because I cut your cables? What's your excuse? Watch out for live wires! But there aren't any. But you just said, now it's a metal ball. Yes, it's a metal ball of flesh and bone. Let's see. Hmm, Charmeleon! Because it was a critical hit. Growl before it uses Sonic Boom like all the rest. We'll use one more growl and then a leer. <laughs> Damn, he got me there. <laughs> and now, Imbar. Luckily, he's not using any Sonic Booms, just Tackles. And now he's gonna use a Sonic Boom to spite me. Ah, good, he missed instead. Let's see what's next. Another Magmamite! Ooh. Quick, Ivasaur! Smack down that Magmamite, now he's gonna be the one that gets Sonic Boomed. Growl! Growl! And now, a tackle! <laughs> he gave you 169 XP. Yeah, when I fought Jesse and James in an earlier cave, they gave me 420. It was magical. No, oh, a magneton? Oh no! This one's gonna use. Th lots of growls. Lots of growls. Wait, you British? Nah, I'm Texas. It's just that I can do. For whatever reason, I kind of slip into British sometimes. And then it goes away. And then it comes back. And then he says, Oi, McGavner! Get to use my super potions or else I die! Foolish Magneton, you cannot get through my salad because my salad is thick and frothy. Now, oh boy, a critical hit, my favorite Pokemon Critical Hit Edition. This is going to be a long battle. Growl, and now he's gonna use Sonic Boom, and it's gonna do a lot of damage, and I'm gonna cry. I predicted the future! I can see the future! Oh, you can see me! It's the most magical fight to ever happen. Three metal balls and a salad going at it. Ah, he won't Sonic Boom twice in a row. Watch as he does. Ah! Ah, he won't miss. Take that, engineer. I've never heard you sound anything like a Texas person. You have sounded like every other language or stereotype. Eh, that's how accents are. Accents are weird. You wanna fight? <laughs> I have never lost! Another gambler man. Wahoo! I'm a gambler man. He is a gambler man. He's ugly. Alrighty then, we're going to send out the st no, 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 we're not going to send out Striker. Striker would be...
You know, bidi 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 bidi. Bidi bidi. Sing my angel of music. How dare you? Sing my angel of music. How dare you not sing properly? I'm giving you the opportunity to sing to the world. Ah! <laughs> I'm scared. We all are. Sing, my angel of music. Hear the wonderful voice of your duet partner. Sing! If only What's Its Name Studios would sponsor me, as obviously I am telling people of their hit movie, Sing, with a sequel out, Sing 2. Hey, it worked. The world is happy, and he's gonna send out a Magnemite to hurt my soul. Sing, my angel of music. Yeah, it worked that time. I am the most magical music manager. <laughs> Didn't Sing 2 come out like three months ago? I don't know. I haven't watched those movies. <laughs> That studio's modus operandi is literally reuse assets as much as possible and make cheap movies. That is their thing. Cheap movies, but super duper marketable. I'm the best in my class. Ah, so you're homeschooled. <laughs> Got him. Youngsters sent out Ratata. I'm going to send out a turtle to kill that rat. <laughs> That's how they get you. Eh, it, de it more depends on... Actually, it's less getting you, and it's more like a philosophy thing, because that's why all their movies feel so samey. It's because they literally reuse assets as much as possible, kind of have the same workflow as much as possible, so that's why everything looks the same, that's why everything feels the same is because everything is as same as possible to save money as much as possible. Ah, Eradicate, huh? Those are scary. Sending out Pikachu. So it's more just like a, eh, I kind of don't like that. Because <laughs> they just feel so much the same. Of course you survive. Now, quick attack! Quick attack that rat! Because I'm already kind of sick and tired of, like, Disney movies feeling and looking the same. Darn! I need to make my Pokémon stronger. I stole his lunch money. There is a rope in a tree. Rope in a tree. Don't think about it too much. Radita, very fitting for a child who lives in a dumpster. I take his class as some garbage and his teacher and his mom that left him. Wow. When you catch lots of Pokemon, isn't it hard to think up names? In Lavender Town, there's a man who rates Pokemon nicknames. He'll help you rename them, too. Looked into the binoculars. The only way to get from Cerulean City to Lavender Town is by way of Rocket Tunnel. Rock Tunnel, not Rocket Tunnel. I'm looking for Lickitung. Want to trade one for Duck Trio? No. Hi, remember me? I'm Professor Oak's aide. If you caught 30 kinds of Pokemon, I'm supposed to give you an item finder. So, Neon, have you caught at least 30 kinds of Pokemon? No. Oh, I see. When you get 30 kinds, come back for item finder. I don't even think I'd really care about item finder that much. I shall save. I just call my Pokemon <laughs> random number... <laughs> Basically, a bunch of random shenanigans. Not even letters, they're symbols. Yep, and this is where Snorlax is. He looks tiny. A sleeping Pokemon blocks the way. Come on, we're strong enough to beat up that Pokemon. 
Ah, and I'll go ahead and teleport, heal up my Pokemon, and then we'll go through Diglett Tunnel. So that we can get Flash. Welcome to the Pokemon Center. Yeah, I never really n nicknamed my Pokemon all that much either. I usually just keep their name basic. Only recently have I started to nickname a Pokemon just to give it more flavor. Except for, like, the starters and Pikachu, just because this is supposed to be the anime. They don't get names. No, no, no. We can't ride our Pokemon just yet. This is a rated E for everyone game. Into the tunnel. Whee! I think they added a Pokemon that's a child turned into a ghost type Pokemon after death. There's a surprising amount of those. What a surprise! Dig Douglas Long Tunnel! It goes right to Viridian City! There's like the. Uh. I forget, it's like something stump. Then there's also the. Pokemon that's just a bunch of spirits tied together. Then there's also the Pokemon that's, uh. Literally. A ceremonial uh, burial mask that is a person who died and became a Pokemon, and then they can evolve into a creepy sarcophagus that sucks people's in and eats them. Oh yeah, and then there's the Pokemon that drags you to hell. Pokemon gets weird. At least I... I guess let's try and capture a, a Diglett, I guess. Might as well use up some of my diddly doos. Go, Pokeball! <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> yeah. Pokemon goes hard. And then there's those odd times where implications are thrown around. The implications of Pokemon human relations. Of the kinky variety. And not even not only in the spin-off games, but in the mainline too. They're very subtle, but only just. Ah! Oh, I for a moment I thought my bubble beam failed. The one <laughs> the one downside of stream delay. After I just bounce topics a bunch and I see we need one of those, makes me wonder. Do they mean Diglett? Or the kinky variety? <laughs> Honestly, hmm. Bubble Beam! I should probably throw someone else into the main so that I can, like, split. Let's see, who's low level? I shall throw. Striker! Because they shouldn't. Striker should be decent. Ah, and right there, we're at the end. Hello, friend. I went to Rock Tunnel, but it's dark and scary. If a Pokemon's Flash could light it up. But where do I get Flash? Where do I get Flash? Where do I get Flash? Flash. Diglett's Cave. But what's over here? What is over here? Where am I? Bill. Many Pokemon live only in forests and caves. You need to look everywhere to get different kinds. Hello, old man. Have you noticed the bushes on the roadsides? They can be cut down by special Pokemon move. Huh? Trainer tips. If you want to avoid battles, stay away from grassy areas. Wait, this is the Viridian Forest? Right, 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 right. Map! What? 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 Aha. Uh -huh. I guess so. Very well. Fair. May God have mercy on your soul. Murder all the children. Murder all the children. Hello, dude. A fainted Pokemon can't fight, but it can still use moves like cut. Hello, child. Give me your cut. I'm looking for Clefairy. Want to trade for Mr. Mime? No. 
where is Flash? Flash, Flash. I need Flash. Once a Pokemon learns Flash, you can get through Rock Tunnel. Then where is the flesh? Hey, remember me? I'm Professor Oak's aide. If you caught ten kinds of Pokemon, I'm supposed to give you an HM5. Uh, I think so. Give? Great, you caught 19 kinds of Pokemon. Congratulations. Here you go. I got the HM. You know that Pokemon Name Raider guy? We can, uh, Rickroll him with Pokemon names? I don't think he cares. He's just like, that is a name. Uh. Neon found HP up. Who deserves the HP up? Who deserves it? God? Certainly not. <laughs> Who deserves it? Who deserves the HP? Who deserves it the most? Well, considering that my Pikachu has the lowest amount of health out of everyone, apparently... You. It didn't seem like it rose that much. Sad. Moonstone, so if I want to, uh... Evolve my Clefair. Well, that's that. Hmm. Uh... Now that I have Flash, we sh Yeah, because Diglett's Cave doesn't really do all that much. I didn't even need to really go through Diglett's Cave. So, let's teleport. Wee! Teleport! Oh! But now I need to teach Flash to someone. Who gets the HM slave? I don't really have much HM slaving going on. Of course Luna can. If we'd get a Charmander of some of, some of those moon rocks, we could get a... If we'd get a Charmander and some of those moon rock things, could we get S Charmander? Ah, uh, no. Charmander doesn't uh, level up or uh, evolve from a Moonstone. He just levels up through Firestones or leveling. That's why I have a Charmeleon. Goodbye, Double Slap. I don't really have much use for you. Double Slap shall be gone. And learned Flash. All right, now bicycle time. Woo! Now we can make progress. <laughs> F. I find it funny that, like, after that, uh, pay F, uh, press F to pay respects meme from Call of Duty, it just took off, and now, whenever something bad or sad, F. <laughs> Internet culture is funny like that. Do we need to... Yeah. Well, nah, we don't really need to, because we can... There's a Pokemon Center right around the corner. Now, we already beat up all the Pokemon trainers over here. Mwahaha! <laughs> I am Jean. Yes. Why? La 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 la. La 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 Heal my Pokemon so that I might damage other Pokemon with hell. Such a cheery tune to enter damnation. And since we already beat this trainer, we don't need to worry about them getting in our way. <laughs> Assert your dominance with a T pose. Is Peppa Pig a Pokemon? No, she's an unholy abomination that deserves to die. You ever face a blinding light so bright you can see in the dark? Striker! Throw sand in its eyes! Pocket sand! And it still leached life from my beloved. 
Jesus, I didn't know you felt strongly about Peppa. Peppa Pig is a monster, an abomination that wants to devour the flesh of the living. Really, all the characters in Peppa Pig are an amalgamation of a single creature luring children in. The narrator, the unnecessary narrator, another piece of the damnation. Pokemon fight! Ready, go! Oh no. We found a cave troll. Like I said, we found a cave troll. Level 23. I throw sand in your eyes. Bleh. Not only am I throwing sand in your eyes, I'm throwing sand in your mother's eyes because you wear your mother's skull on your head. Skull on skull. Double skull for the skull throne. My throne. Or Peppa Pig's throne, depending on how you think about it. Quit lowering my defense, please. I need that. When I play Pokemon long enough, it just evolves into randomness. Where it's just like, things. Things upon things. Quit headbutting the bird! Quick attack, faster! <laughs> Who is the narrator? Why is Peppa cheese? Where is my Doritos? Is San Tasty? Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. Basically, basically, yeah. Hey, Pikachu. Actually, Ivasaur. Die. We shall defeat your Slowpoke. Cut off its tail and eat it. Because they're a delicacy. <laughs> Game over! Game. Gotta heal up Striker so he doesn't die. Oh no! It's a Machop! He's going to Karate Chop me! You know, Karate Chop! That, that normal move that just gets a million crits. Hate. Not good, it didn't get a crit that time. But considering that that only happens like one out of three times. Okay, I think we're getting lucky now. Maybe the crits are going home. Maybe the, maybe the, the crits went home for the winter. 25 days into December. I maybe should have gotten Repel, but I also want to level up my Pokemans. My Pokeman! You've heard of Coke Man. Now get ready for Poke Can. Okay, that's a lot of damage. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I'm still annoyed that Gust is not. <laughs> An air attack. It's normal. Why is it normal? Why? Why? Oh, that's just a trick. It's a dead end. Why? Once more. The letter Y. This episode is brought to you by the letter Why? Gotta bring out War Turtle. Well, actually, uh, Ivysaur. Because despite the fact that we have an air Pokemon, a flying type, no, it doesn't have any flying moves for some reason, because Gust is normal. Like, once again, I understand that Gust is labeled as normal, probably for the sake of early game players, so that people don't just go, Oh, why is this early game Pokemon critting my starter five billion times in a row? And so they're like, fine, we'll make Pidgey's starting move a normal attack for balancing. And then it just hurts my soul every single time. Every single time. 
Doot do do. Mama. Limo. Oh no, not super scenic. This isn't owned by Sega. And that's why whenever Supersonic is used on Pokemon, they get confused because they're like, but we're not owned by Sega. And then Smash Brothers Brawl happened, and nobody knows what to make of anything anymore. And that's why everyone's dying. Maybe Luna will be able to save the day. Will you fight me? Who are you? I draw Pokemon when I'm home! Oh, hey, same! The real question is... From your outfit, I'm going to assume it's the... Kinky kind. Ah, shit, it's level 25. Sing! My angel of music! <laughs> you foolish slowpoke. You are slow, and now I will poke you. And by poke you, I mean pound! Mwahahahaha. <laughs> you know, th I wonder if there's a Pokemon like trait where it, like, because traits in Pokemon are basically like each Pokemon type. Like, uh, oh, like Pikachu, and then like, uh,. Squirtle, like, each of those have a different, uh, like, set of traits that they can have in, like, later Pokemon games. So it would be interesting if, like, Snorlaxes and Slowpokes have a chance to be, like, if they are put to sleep by an enemy Pokemon, that it counts as a rest move and they get health back when asleep. sleep. That would be cool. And kind of a landmine. Annoyed by people putting your Pokemon to sleep? Well, turn that around on them, and then you can have Snorlax use, use sleep talk and hyper beam them while asleep. Do you think media share is an option? Um, I'm I'm trying to think like what media share is. Is that the? Uh, if I'm correct, because uh, I'm not like super duper streamer man, but if I'm correct, str uh, uh, media share is basically ah people can donate and then uh, have like a YouTube video pop up. Depending on, like, uh, how the settings go, like, depending on how the ratio of money to time, but, uh, uh, media share is not an option here, because I don't know how to set it up, and I'm not sure if it's really super worth it to me. <laughs> so it's like, I don't know, maybe if I have consistent viewers in the future, but at the same time, like, uh copyright uh, bots or a thing where it's just like aha uh -huh, music is playing hone in on you and mute the VOD like even though I'm like recording it so I could like uh, edit out that part of the VOD but still have me talking so yeah but it's just like uh... then there's also the annoying thing where people also take like Undertale music Oh, like, my favorite example is this one guy uh, took, like, this Beethoven song, put, like, random de -de 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 blips and bloops at the beginning and end, and then for the rest of, of the middle, it's just that Beethoven song. It's just like, see, it's my music and stealing. It's just annoying. Copyright is annoying. <laughs> yeah, but you have a free option, and the limit is, like, five minutes. True. I don't come here, uh... I, I, I skip because bring. But I will fight you. I was just, probably just like, I didn't mean to come here, but I'll fight you. I don't want to be here, but I'll fight you. Feisty girl. Don't die in the caves. So yeah, basically media share is something to maybe in the future. But it's just like right now. Eh. It's, it, it kind of reminds me of the reason why I don't have uh, follower notifications. Like, when I first started uh, streaming, I had, like, all the notifications set up and ready to go. Uh, but uh, the reason I got rid of my follower notifications, so sorry for people that follow and actually intend to, like, drop by once in a while, but the reason why I don't shout out followers and don't have a follower notification is because there was a period of time 
like a year or two ago where people would come in, follow, and I'd be like, hey there, doo doo doo, thank you for following. And then, like, immediately after, they would unfollow and leave and never come back. So I just. Uh, basically, I don't really care about followers that much anymore. It's just like, are you a real person? Are you going to return at some point? I don't know! <laughs> so, like, I do appreciate followers, but it's just like, eh. <laughs> I don't want to give them gratification. Those vain people. <laughs> My eyes are in need of complex colors in this game. Same. It, there was a point in time when I first started playing Pokemon Yellow, where it's just like, the certain colors were hurting my eyes. About to use Bulbasaur? I'm gonna murder that Bulbasaur. That Bulbasaur is gonna be murdered by me. I'm gonna leer. Because right now, I'm just kind of like, yeah. Certain colors are hurting my eyes now, actually. Yeah, that's the kind of the downside of, like, early Game Boy. Well, not even early. This is... I, was, I literally watched, like, a Did You Know Gaming uh, video. I think actually today. And uh, <laughs> the guy that was making Pokemon actually went to a barber and uh, was having a chat with his barber, and the barber is just like, oh, you're making a game, uh, what for? Uh, the Game Boy. He's just like, oh, the Game Boy? You're kind of late on that, aren't you? And that's why, uh, uh, Porygon was made in the first place. It was a jab at people like, why aren't you making, like, those Polygon games for the Nintendo 64 instead? And he's just like, fine, you want Polygons? Here, have Porygon. Yep, just another dead end, but I had to check. Because you don't know, there could have been a there could have been an item! It's an RPG! Could have been an item! Oh yeah, I forgot you're a rock. Damn it. You ever forget that a rock is a rock? Join the You Did Not Know It Was a Rock support program today. Oh yeah, I got completely sidetracked, but yeah, just Game Boy Color colors sometimes are wonky and can hurt. I can't wait for the Game Boy Advance, or at least or at least Pokemon Crystal. I think Pokemon Crystal will be better. The creator of Pokemon, today I updated the game to have your mother as a new Pokemon. <laughs> no, but he did uh, <laughs> a fun another funny story from that Did You Know Gaming video. That apparently, at one point, the creator of Pokemon came across a uh, Pokemon cartridge, like I guess at like a flea market or something. God damn it, I forgot to read. It said something about costume. But hello, Pokemaniac. I'm just into the story. I'm into the story time, Billy! But yeah, basically, uh, he found a. Uh, found or was given a cartridge of Pokemon with the cre uh, the character name as Dumbass. And he actually gave it away for like a charity event. <laughs> and that's hilarious. The official Dumbass cartridge. I shall now send out Luna to put your creature to sleep so that it can pound in its sleep and screams will not be heard. Pound that cue bone into dust. Make it meet its family. Ah, it woke up. Oh, no. It's going to headbutt my poor Clefairy. No. Oh, it's just going to tail whip. Don't give in. Keep up the offensive. Ah, crap. Aha, you missed your bone club. Oh, and speaking of flesh and bone, there's the bones. 
They all belong to the cue ball. It would be hilarious if he just said, yeah, the dumbass game cartridge is now a consistent timeline and plot point in Pokemon. And that, po well, funnily enough, Pokemon did kind of get in. I forgot to read again! Ah! I'm getting too caught up. But at the same time, that's a good distraction to have. Doo -doo -doo. Ah! You take one step and you don't succeed. Damnation coming for me. Ah, damnation in the form of a Geodude. Geodud. Geowa. Waru Geo. Now, Waluigi, he's the real Pokemon. Oh, yeah, I, I keep getting distracted, but funnily enough, Pokemon has gone into the realm of alternate timelines, like, as canon, so. Multiverse is canon. Yet another Geodude. Geodude. Dude. Dude! It fears for its life, so it curls up so that it may die in a nice, compact form. It is another Geodude, here to Geodie. At this point, I really should just move... Luna off because it's all Geo dudes. Why? It's like I have witnessed the death of my brothers, all of them dying, over and over. But I say, no more. And self destructs. And that's how the Boo Saga went for Vegeta. And also, going on the time, uh, dumbass uh, timeline for Pokemon, isn't that just Ash? That's just Ash. Hit me with your best shot! I'm gonna punch your kidney out. Mwahaha! <laughs> I'm Fat Man. It's a fighting type. Put it to sleep! With tranquilizer music. No! And then Clefairy got kicked in the nuts. What is Duke Nukem? Duke Nukem is your stepfather. Your ass is grass, and I've got the lawnmower. Stop trying to kick my Clefairy's balls. It's trying to sing. My Clefairy already can reach the high notes. It doesn't need the help. <laughs> Why stop the narrator voice, please, I beg you. At this point, my brain is mush. I don't know which way is what. Put it to sleep. Put it to sleep. <laughs> Have mercy. There can be no mercy, for I have none. My brain is M.A.S.H. It's been forever since I watched M.A.S.H. Yes, that is a show. I think it's about, like, a, a medical compound during the Vietnam War? Or was it a Korean War? I think it might have been the Korean War. Maybe. I don't know. My brain is dead. Ah, Onyx. <laughs> now when playing Doom Eternal, I found out my favorite color is violence. Yeah, that that tracks. Time for the bubble beam. Fucking bubbles. Critical hit bubbles. You ever seen a bubble explode with the force of Hiroshima? Trying to learn bite. Hmm. Sure. I think the uh, loose tackle. I think bite's a decent move. And now my war turtle can bite rocks. Fired away! It 
It is the Zubat. The Zubat must die. 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 Pikachu. Hey, you, Pikachu. Thunderbolt. You dare bite my Pikachu? My Pikachu responds with death. My Pokemon techniques will leave you crying. Please don't threaten me with a good time, sir. It's just a single Geo, dude. It is level 25. But it is still just fucking Geo, dude. I have a challenge for you. Oh no. Try to answer one question. Depends on the question, really. That's not really a challenge. I guess depends on the question, but... Thank you. I give! You're a better technician! You mean tactician? Where do Pokemon come from? Eggs! And now the next question is, where do eggs come from? Rule 34. Now, throw it away with Ember. What's rule 34? I'll tell you when you're older. I'll look it up, one sec. No, he'll discover the 34th rule of the... Construction Code of America or something, I don't know. Minimize. Nah, I don't need that. I'd have to get rid of pound. Like, I can't get rid of anything. I have locked my poor Luna into a specific diddly dee. Ah. Trying to stop learning a move is more difficult than learning a move, apparently. Should probably heal up some of me Perkimans. There we go, all my Pokemon topped off and ready for battle. And I should probably swap them around a bit. Switch. Charmeleon should be getting some intestines. This tunnel goes a long way, kid! And see an Enderman? That's why you don't look up rules to the United States uh, playoff safety codes. The very sacred rules. Not for the weary of heart. They're like Elder Scrolls. They'll take your eyes. God dang it. He's rock. He's rock solid. Uh. He threw rocks in my salad. Oh no, my eyes are gone. Funnily enough, that's probably covered in under Rule 34 as well. He's about to use Machop. Now Charmeleon can have some fun. Leer sultrily at him. Rule 34 Pokemon. Yeah, that's just Lopani. Goddamn Karate Chop! Ember. I hate Karate Chop. Karate Chop eats my soul. Eats me out of house and home. Eats my home. Now, scratch his abs. It's his only defining feature.
is about to use Geodude. Go, Ivysaur! Last time on Dragon Ball Z, Krillin was able to actually do shit. But now it's Dragon Ball Super, and now we'll have to come up with some contrived reason why he's capable. But Tien, he can get fucked. Why? Apparently has something to do with China. Tien is not liked. It's like 2.50 right now. You should go to sleep. Uh, unless it's like 2.50 p.m., but even then, if you need a nap, you need a nap. I would not begrudge the loss of viewership, mainly because I need my viewers alive. <laughs> Fight me, hiker man. Hmm. Maybe I'm lost in here. You'll be lost when you're out of Pokemon, my boy. Go, War Turtle. We'll send that Onyx to the Gulag. Now I'm reminded of the fact that there are canonical Pokemon Wars. So it's just like... Human beings and Pokemon fighting side by side to kill. Those are dark and disturbing days. Like seriously, an Onyx wants to kill you, you're, you're just dead. Onyx, Onyx, Geodude, huh? <laughs> no, I won't go to sleep. But your eyes, Indemon! Your eyes! He's up! What am I doing? Which way is out? And now, he'll be stuck here. Forever. Outsiders like you need to show me some respect. Do you live here? Go, Ivysaur. Leave my salad alone. Vine whip. Whip it good. I'm actually gonna have to use one of the ethers. No, I can deal with the pain. My eyes haven't closed to ensure maximum screen radiation doses. Well, it's less that, and like actually, my brother told me this. It's less about act the the light from the screen, and it's more the fact of like a. Uh, a disparity in how much light there is. So, like, if you're in the dark and you only have, like, your computer screen on, you're going to have uh, an imbalance as your eyes kind of strain to uh, normalize the light. <laughs> I give! So, basically, if you are going to sit in front of a computer for long periods of time, make sure to actually have... Uh, enough light in your room that your eyes aren't straining as much. Yeah, I have to heal because he can get freaking. Emily's my favorite karate chub boy! I've had some sleep probs from like five days ago. Now that's really unhealthy. I have a hard enough time staying up to like 12 at night to midnight and being like, now nah, I will go to bed. Sleep is important. It's how that makes sure that you can stay awake longer later. Unhealthy? Nah, I'm fine. I don't believe you. Your eyes are gone.
Man, everything's getting burned today. My Charmeleon must be really good at roasting. <laughs> you stay up at 12? <laughs> 6 a.m. It's mostly because I want to have the illusion of actually having a decent sleep schedule. That's mostly it. Ah, level 21, eh? You're actually worth killing. Music! Move to the muse! I like how he's using leech life when he's losing more life than he's leeching to the burn. When will we find a strong opponent? Eh, probably... Sp well, I doubt anything's going to match Rage. Eh, do I want Rage? I don't think Rage. Nah, I don't think so. No. No. Oh, that's a dead end. Oh, no. Are you going to fight me? You're going to die. Hey, hikers leave twigs as trail markers. I doubt that. But, uh... Strong opponents... <laughs> I, the entire point of this game is to, like, avoid doing that. To be the strong opponent that they are facing. Facing a strong opponent is basically, oh dear, oh god, uh, <laughs> fighting Brock back at the beginning when I had no Pokemon that could actually face up to Brock Pokemon. I'll use this frying pan as a drying pan. My voice cracked strangely. Ah! Hey, Pikachu. In this cave, there's something that can conduct electricity. Arr! Thunderbolt! Also, is there only a male or female choice? In the first generation of Pokemon, uh, you can only play as a boy. But then starting with Pokemon Crystal in the, the third uh, version of the second generation game, you could uh, choose between being a boy and a girl as they expanded the technology. Gender options coming to the Game Boy. <laughs> Damn, Pokemon doesn't support LGBTQ rights. But that's the point of Gardevoir and Gallade. Well, mainly Gardevoir. Because Gardevoir can be any gender. And that's what makes it great. I was gonna put Pikachu up there, but then he'd probably get annihilated by everything. War Turtle is just taking over because we've been in this cave for five billion years! Another dead end! Get away from me, Zubat. You are not worth killing. Ah, a Geodude. You are worth burying. If you bury a Geodude under a bun bunch of rock... Is that like burying somebody under a bunch of dandruff? Those have been running that guy. I need my, my, my brain. It doesn't keep up with my brain. My brain is too fast for my brain, and now it's a hiker. Goddamn. Can you match my power? I will. I'll kick your ass. Hiker wants to fight! But can he beat my might? All might will win. How dare you defense curl in this house? Whip it good. Yay, level 35! Well, 
That'd be amazing jumping ten levels, but near. Do not change. Kill that Geo dude with another vine whip. Crack the stone with your vines. Ooh, a graveler, huh? We will blow him away with bubbles! Say something sus. I didn't vent from the confect. Oh, I said touch a million. Yeah, that's probably sus enough. Send out the bubble beam. The bubble team. My boba tea. We murdered a graveler. Oops, out-muscled. There are no muscles in bubbles. But where, where do I go? Oh. It's another Geo dude. But it's not worth killing. Ah! He was right in the middle. He knew where I would be. You have a Pokedex? I want one too. You can't have mine. It's my encyclopedia. It's a Pokemaniac. Thunderbolt! He's gonna send out another Slowpoke to die. Thunderbolt! Another Slowpoke! It's all-you-can-eat buffet for Pikachu! Especially because, yeah, in the second game, they reveal that Slowpoke tails are an illegal delicacy. Like shark fin soup. Shoot, I'm so jealous! You know, that guy basically just tried to mug me. It's very rude. Eek, don't try anything funny in the dark. There's nothing to say here. The horror. No, Pika. Instead, Charmeleon! Not the stun spore! Ember! Oh, and now it's using rap, too. How dare you? Why? Why do you hurt me? My poor Charmeleon dinosaur boy. He did nothing to you. He was going to, but now he can't. And that's just sad. Let my boy kill you, Bellsprout. How long will this rap go? Oh, I thought he, th he used rap again. Let me fight you, you plant bastard! It's hard to differentiate between it using rap and the attack continuing. I have to use quick attack. It's just too fast. Haha. Uh -huh. Now, sand attack. Die plant. <laughs> And of course, it used sleep powder, because it's a jackass. Finally, a worthy opponent. Our battle will be long and arduous. Most annoying jackass in the West. 
quit using rap! <laughs> Damn, we actually have to use strategy here. Send attack! Make him miss! Quick attack! You little bastard! Die! Die, Platman! Die! Because for a moment there with Charmeleon, I just thought that it was a really long rap. No! No! It just it was faster than my Charmeleon and constantly was using rap! It was the slowest death possible. Another Thunderbolt for b b anger spite. Junior Trainer, it was too dark! And I won lots of money. You have a Pokemon, let's fight! We almost got killed, <laughs> Friday Night Funkin' style. <laughs> well, you sent the worst Pokemon to fight my Pikachu. Oh yeah, level up! I was about to use a Rattata, huh? Who should go out and fight? Striker, you need to level up! Kill that rat! Put sand in his eyes. Pocket sand. And now, quick attack. Who's the faster? Me. I'm fast. I am speed. Another ratata, huh? Quick, pocket sand! And now... Quick attack! <laughs> I am Spies! You think you are slick? I am an oil slick! Oh boy, another bell sprout! No, we won't... Switch, but we will heal because fuck this dude. I now have an egregious hatred towards Bell Sprouts. I'm gonna double pocket sand his eyes and then quick attack him to death. Of course, you'd poison powder because you're an asshole. Uh, I was trying to do the uh, rap poison combo. Death by a million tiny cuts. Except it cuts you two times a time. I'm a gonna be a growing boy. No, you're gonna be dead in the ground. You're gonna be the fertilizer that feeds this world, you, 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 little, you little leaf stem. Bell sprout more like bellend. I don't have any antidotes. You play hard. You poisoned my boy! Oh boy, it's a geodude. I, I, I hate G's. Go away, GD. My boy, I'm going to fight another. I came this far for Pokemon. You came this far, and now you're going to die, little girl. Haha, <laughs> you said a cat? I'm going to kill it. Thunder! Where are we going again? Through the cave, so that we can get to Lavender Town. After that, I don't know, because I was planning on stopping then, and it's been going for so long!
because I was like, oh, we're gonna go through here, but then it's like super dark, so it's like, okay, we're gonna go through Digwit Cave to get Flash, and that took a little bit. And now we come back here to the uh, this rock tunnel so that we can flash it, go through, and make progress. <laughs> Wilbur Soot really said while you were fighting him, why do you have to kill my cat? <laughs> The cat must die because it is in the way. Ah, oh, Pidgey, huh? I'm going to electrocute it with a giant thunderbolt! This game won't be canon until a hundred Pidgey are dead. I'm out of Pokémon! You came this far, and now you failed. Rock Tunnel, Cerulean City, Lavender Town. We're almost through, but I'm gonna go check out the left because I want to see if there's anything there, because I have to know. I have to know, Bill. I have to know what the truth is at the end of the tunnel. Run away! Nope, it's just another dead end. There wasn't a single Pokeball in this entire place, I think. Profound sad. Hello. I'm feeling a bit faint from this tough hike, and it's good. <laughs> We're all. Oh yeah, because we have to fight a bunch of people on the way to Lavender Town too. But at least we're out of the cave! <laughs> hey Pikachu, wanna kill another Pidgey? How do you even have a Pidgey? They evolve into Pidgeotto at like level 18. Like 75 voice changes later, we're finally here. Yeah, that tracks. Pikachu was unaffected by Whirlwind. And that's your loss. Oh, a Pidgeotto, huh? You actually do have one. Please don't kill. Thank you. But I'll kill you. Critical Thunder. Ha 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 ha. I am the victor. No, I'm not up to it. But you know what you are up to? My nerves! But now things should be relatively simple because we just have trainers to deal with. Ha 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 ha! Oh no, it's me. Hiker wants to fight. Hiker wants to banter. Slash him with a vine va. And then he died. And they don't stop coming and they don't stop coming. They keep the onyx coming and they keep on rolling. On the mind nerves and I got to say, a Pokemon champion is how I'm gonna stay. You think there's been multiple murders using Pokemon? Yeah, probably. I'm not laughing. <laughs> hey, Fever. Ha <laughs> Chew. I'm going to murder your entire family using Pokemon. Or, you know, one of these escape rope, either or. Ah, oh, let's check out this tree. Found Max Ether. Almost there. Hey, hi, kid. Want to see my Pokemon? That sounds like an innuendo. Hey, kid. Want to see my Diglett? And of course, it's another Pokemaniac. I'm going to send out my Cubone. My Cubone. Random child jokes on you. All right. 
I shall send out Luna to bash in that Cubone's face, which is its mother's face, but is dead. <laughs> About you, Slowpoke. Turn it to ash with sings. My favorite. And now we will murder the Slowpoke in its sleep. <laughs> Smack it down, Billy. Smack it down. Kill the Slowpoke. I don't think we... We've only ever seen Slowpokes use confusion. And they never really got that far. Huzzah! Oh no! My Pokemon! And he gave me a thousand dollars. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. And I guess I'll put War Turtle back in top because I think there's one more dude to kill. This guy. Ah, this mountain air is delicious. Is it really mountain air if it's just like right next to a graveyard? Hiker wants to fight. A level 19 Onyx. It's not that scary, dude. Bubble Beam. I'm really tired of fighting. Well, that's mostly what Pokemon is. <laughs> He's gonna use a Graveler. Luckily, when you know what you're up against, it goes really fast. That cleared my head. What did you get bashed in? To the Pokemon Center! New Silphsco! Make the invisible plane to see, Silphco! And now, I shall get off my bike so we can hear the legendary music. Ghosts appeared in Pokemon Tower. I think they're the spirits of Pokemon that the rockets killed. I have to heal my Pokemon or else the poison will get in the way of the music. Your Pokemon are fighting fit. We hope to see you again. Nope, nope, nope. I want to leave. Be gone, Satan. Team Rocket will do anything for the sake of gold. Gold? Cubones wear skulls, right? People will pay a, a lot for one. I saw Cubone's mother die trying to escape from Team Rocket. Either I never talked to these people, or they really <laughs> laid it out plain in the yellow version. This is a town known is known as the gravesite of the Pokemon. Memorial services are held in the Pokemon Tower. Lavender Town, the noble purple town. Do you believe in ghosts? Yes. Really? So there are believers. May the souls of Pokemon rest easy. Pokemon Tower. I always did love the music of Lavender Town. Lavender Volunteer Pokemon House. That's odd. Mr. Fuji isn't here. Where'd he go? Pokemon Monthly Grand Prize. Drawing! The application form is gone! It's been clipped out! This is really Mr. Fuji's house. He's really kind. He looks after abandoned and orphaned Pokemon. Psyduck. Guapa. Do Pokemon die of age? Most likely. Though some are probably older than others. I hate those horrible rockets. That poor Cubone's mother. He was killed trying to escape from Team Rocket. Yeah, they just lay it on thick here.
And then it's, hello, I am the official name rater. Want me to the name of your Pokemon? Sure. Which Pokemon should I look at? How about Striker? Yeah, that is a decent nickname. But would you like to give a nick nicer name? How about it? No. Fine, come anytime you like. But we are finally here. Let me quickly check my map. Wrong one. No, I don't want to get on my bike. I wanted to check my map. Map. Even though it's hard to use. So now we can get... We should be able to get by... So we either we... We'll probably go to the left just to see if we can do anything. See if we can make it by. But the guards will probably say, Oh, I'm thirsty. You can't go by. So we'll probably have to make our way to Fatruzia City, or however the hell you say it. Unless, uh, Snorlax is also blocking that way. It's entirely possible. It's a double block, and we need to get the Pokemon Flute, which requires us to get the Silphscope. And it's just... But, that will be next time. Because we've been going for a long time this time. Because I've been having lots of fun. But that'll be it, and we'll end in Lavender Town, a fitting place to end, you know, on Christmas! <laughs> but anyway, that will do it for now. Thank you very much for joining me tonight, and I hope to see you next time. If you want more from me, you can find me on YouTube, Twitter, Twitch, Newgrounds, and other such social medias. Yeah, uh, I'm just going to be doing things. I have no idea when, but I'll probably pop up with a gremlin VTuber avatar once I get around to playing with VTuber Live 2D creation software. But anyway, thank you very much for watching. I've been Neon Icy Wings. This has been Pokemon Yellow version, or as I call it, Critical Hits Edition. And I will see you all next time. Bye. Bye.